Mike check one two one two. Mike check one two one two. Hope everybody's having a great evening. Hope we having a great hump day Wednesday. We back for another live stream. I just did a members only live stream last night. Doing some final checks here. I got a little extra footage coming up here. See, we had quite a few people in here. We ready to get down to business, man. Oh, you know what? Let me get my hat. I'm tripping. I didn't even do anything to my hair today. Your boy just ready to rock and roll. See, we got three people in the crib. And without any further ado. Ladies, Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, today we come to you live from the Dallas Fort Worth area to, to see and hear. hear. A knowledgeable, a knowledgeable content, content creator. creator. From, From Arlington, Arlington Texas, Texas, we bring to you the one, the only, People's Chef, Chef Rod, Rod, a.k.a. AKA PBT. You, you know, know what time, time it is. is. Let's, Let's roll, roll, baby. baby. Let's, hey man, hope everybody's having a great day. Your boy's here and ready to rock and roll. Let me get me on the screen and get all this other stuff off here. Hope everybody's having a great day. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to another Points Blank Travel live stream. Y'all gotta excuse me. I ain't feel like doing nothing to my hair because I was supposed to get a haircut today and didn't. So your boy got a well, I don't even think I have an appointment tomorrow. I need to make an appointment for tomorrow. Uh I do have a pretty interesting topic lined up for today. Uh, once again, it's becoming a norm. I apologize for the delay. There were a couple of uh, technical issues because I do want to share some with you guys. I see we got eight people in the crib, five people ringing the doorbell. And as you come into the house, make sure you ring that doorbell and the doorbell is that like button down below. I do have some uh, extra footage I was out and about this weekend, man, and I'm gonna get down to the topic and the, well, a couple of things I wanna disclose. First and foremost, I did a, a video the other day on cryptocurrency, and please, man, I shared it with the members. We had a members only live stream last night. No, I'm not changing the channel to an investment channel. If you listen, and I'm gonna say it again here in a minute to my intros. Matter of fact, why don't I do it right now? Allow me to reintroduce myself. Hey, welcome to Points Blank Travel, everyone. My name is Rod, and on this channel, we talk about credit. We talk about credit cards. We talk about personal finance, i.e. stocks, bonds, crypto, and how to make money with points, miles, cashback, how to travel around the world with little or no money out of your pocket. If there's something you're interested in, do me a favor if you haven't already done so, subscribe to the channel. Get a video a thumbs up and in the live streams I always say, Hit that doorbell, ring the doorbell, ding dong, baby, as you come in here. And it's cool if you forget to ring it on the way in, make sure, excuse me, you ring it on the way out. Share the channel with your family and friends, share it on your social media platforms. With all that being said, I gotta say it one more time, let's roll, baby, let's get down into it. But I do, uh, that's number one. Number two, y'all gotta, excuse me, man, I just took a super hot shower to kind of get hyped up. Uh, I didn't really take a nap today. I laid in the bed for 32 minutes prior to this live stream because I had a lot going on today. Didn't even get a chance to shoot a video today. Didn't even get my hair. Now I'm starting to wonder, what did I do today? I, it don't seem like I did anything. But anyway, I got an opportunity. I had an opportunity today to get, I mean, not today. This past weekend, I had one of my boys, man. I've known this guy since night we worked together in 1994, and I'm starting to date myself. Uh, had two guys. Well, he flew in from California, from Sacramento, and another homeboy that lives here in Dallas, Rich DeJoy. We hung out all weekend. Uh, your boy couldn't roll Saturday because we stayed out until I got back to my hotel room to hide Regency at 5.20 a.m. Saturday morning. And I had to be at work at 1 o'clock in the afternoon, Saturday afternoon. So, you know, I was tired, so I didn't do anything. And then Sunday, we linked back up, hit a couple spots. I had a lot of footage, man. I had a lot of footage. And don't worry, I'm gonna get down into the topic, man. I'm gonna get into the topic. Why pay an annual fee on a credit card? Why would you? Why would you want to? I mean, there's so many no annual fee cards out there. Why would you wanna pay an annual fee? Don't worry, I'm gonna get down into the topic, but I do have a, 
A little footage that I want to share here. Let me uh, minimize something here. Let me bring this up. Let me share my screen here. And it's just, it's, it's a little, little something different here. And just to give you guys an idea, and this is going to tie into what I'm going to talk about now, tonight, on why you want to pay an annual fee. This is the Hyatt Regency downtown Dallas, Texas uh, at Reunion Tower. And I'm going to just go ahead. This could be about a minute. Let me turn this up a little bit because it may be kind of hard to hear. Just doing a little something different here. This I got one of my new one of my new Because he's uh, an amazing film, I just hate it. Come out already, come out right already, right 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 don't get 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 don all right man just a little something different man and that was us Kicking in me and my homeboys down at uh, Reunion Tower. When we got 13. Oh, hold on, man. I got all. Hold on. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Ain't no telling what I got going on here. Hold on. Let me I got one of my dudes saying. One of my dudes saying. Oh, man. I don't know why that came back on. Hold on. Wait a minute. Let me make sure I kill that, man. Let me, uh, let me turn this all the way off. There we go. All right, man. Boy, I tell you, these programs be throwing me off sometime. All right, let's get down into this. Get that off the screen. All right, we got 11 people in the crib. Now, let me get down into this topic, man. I just had to do a little something different. Got 10 thumbs up. 10 people right in the doorbell. I really appreciate it, man. We had a great time. And that was uh, Friday night. That was the first night. That was the night I decided to stay out all night long and uh, lost my mind. And sorry about the uh, echo, man. I apologize for that. And I'm just noticing, I see Mr. Mentor and Sean. Man, I, I can't hear what y'all are hearing, so totally apologize. And I guess I got to do some sound checks. But anyway, let me get down into this topic. Why pay an annual fee on a credit card? You know, I, I, can look, at, I look at some of the cards I have. I look at the Freedom Flex card, zero uh, annual fee. I look at my Freedom Unlimited card, no annual fee. I look at my Bank of America Cash Rewards card, no annual fee. Then I look at some of my other cards, my City Advantage Business Platinum Select card. I look at my American Express Gold card, my American Express Platinum card, my World of Higher card, and they all have annual fees, and I'm going to break it down. But why, why would you, me, or anybody want to pay an annual fee on a credit card? And it really depends. Here's the answer. It really depends on do you see any value with paying an annual fee on a credit card. Now, if you just have a credit card and don't understand how it works, don't understand the perks and the benefits, you probably won't see any value. But let's just say you have a, I'm gonna start with a City American Airlines card. Let's say you have that card. It has a $99 annual fee and you fly once every three years and you're paying 99, 99, 99. And on the third year, you decide to take a flight. That let's forget this 99, let's just say it's a hundred bucks. You spent $300 in annual fees and haven't gone anywhere, you're about to take your first trip in the third year. Does that make sense to have that card? Probably not. But if you fly once, twice a year, would it make sense to have an annual fee card that has a $99 annual fee? Worth, and I'm going to go over the Delta Gold card. I didn't break down all the cards. I mean, you guys will get the gist of this. But to have an American Airlines card or to have a Delta card, if you pay a $99 annual fee, you fly once, two, three times a year, would it make sense to pay a $99 annual fee? 
Let's go a step further. You, you, you get a, a hotel credit card, the Hilton card, the Marriott card. I'm going to talk about my favorite card, the World of High card. You got this hotel card, but you stay at a hotel once every two years or once a year. Would it make sense to have the World of High card if you only stayed at a hotel once a year? And the annual fee is $95? Probably wouldn't make much sense. But I'm gonna, gonna go in a little deeper detail here. I'm gonna beg to differ because uh, it could make a little sense. So, a couple things to think about. When you look at a car with an annual fee, does it make sense? Are you gonna benefit from the annual fee? Also, can, and can you justify? Can you justify? Can you justify? I just got a credit card. Stay tuned for a video. The world, uh, uh, city airline, city. Advantage American Airlines executive card. It's a $400 and $450 annual fee. Can I justify paying a $450 annual fee? I don't know yet. You got to stay tuned and check out the later in the video. Also, uh, these credit card companies, when you see these $95 annual fees, they're, they're going to give you perks. Now, I'm going to tell you, all here come a nugget. Here come a boulder, whatever you want. It's really a nugget. It's not even a boulder. Well, it is actually. The higher your annual fee on a credit card, typically, the more, more perks you get. The higher your annual fee, $450, let's look at the American Express Platinum card, $550 annual fee. But the perks that come with this card, and I'm gonna go over some stuff, some stats here, and I'm gonna go ahead and answer the question that's probably killing some people and probably not, don't even matter to other people. Now, when these annual fees, credit card companies, they don't want you to use these perks because it costs them money. If they can get Rod to pay a, a $99 annual fee on his American Airlines card from City, but never fly anywhere and don't take advantage of the perks, then they're coming out ahead. But when you start taking advantage of the perks, yeah, they get their $99 annual fee, but it's kind of a wash. And I'm about to tell y'all right now, and I'm telling you right now, you know, we got less roll, baby. We got all kind of sands over here. Pull out your hard hats right now, because I'm about to drop some boulders right now forget gems forget nuggets i'm about to drop some boulders right now and i'm going to give you some examples i do i don't know if uh, your favorite couples in here but i do have my spiral notebook here because i jotted down some notes today most of this i had memorized but i didn't want to leave anything out so we've been talking about this city advantage card this american airlines city advantage card it has a 99 dollars annual fee my favorite perk, and I, I just upgraded my personal card to the executive card to $450. And if, and I, talk, I may talk about that when I don't have it in my notes. But I also have the business version of this card, $99 annual fee. So, I'm paying $99 a month. And let's just say I fly once a year. If I check one bag, I can check one bag, or, or yeah, one bag for men up to eight companions, free. But let's say I don't, I'm not ever going to travel with eight people. I'm not going to say never, but I don't ever plan on it. But let's just say me and one of my homies, me and, and, and a friend, whoever, we travel together. That's two people. $30 for me, that's what it costs to check your bag in with America. $30 for my friend, that's 60 bucks. And that's one way. Round trip, that's 120 bucks. I just got my 99 bucks, my $100 back, plus $20. And that is one flight. Now I'm flying three times a year, me and a friend three times a year, that's 360 bucks that I'm saving on check bags. And I'm paying a $99 annual fee. Does it make sense to pay an annual fee? Yeah, it does. Check one, <laughs> all right? Yes, in this instance, it makes sense to pay an annual fee. What if you have a family of four people? You, your spouse, two kids, everybody got a check bag. That's four bags one way, that's 120 bucks one way. 240 round trip. Duh, I'm not that much of a mathematician. I've just doubled my money that I would have been paying. I already, I'm only paying 99 bucks. Then I get priority boarding. I mean, 20% off in flight, does it make sense for me to pay this $99 annual fee? Yes, it does. The Delta Gold card is similar. I'm not gonna go all, over all that. Uh, it's the same instance. It's a $99 annual fee, the same scenario I just listed. Let's talk about this World of Hyatt card. I just used this card last two, three, five days ago, whatever it was. The World of Hyatt card has a $95 annual fee. The hotel room I got was, after everything was said and done, 
207 bucks, 207. With the world of high card, I get a one free night every year from a category one to a category four hotel. This hotel I stayed in was a category three, I believe. Maybe a four. I could have used my certificate, but I didn't. I, pay, I, used, I, I used my car. Why did I use my car? Because I got eight times the points, but that's a whole different story. So a $95 annual fee on my world of higher card, but if I would have used my free night certificate that I haven't used in two years, and they, they do expire after one year, but because of the current situation, the pandemic, they let them roll over from last year, so I have two of them. $207 room, $95 annual fee. I'm winning, baby. Yes. Does it make sense for me to pay an annual fee for this car? Yeah, because I would never, I'm not going to say never. I'm going to make sure I never find a Hyatt hotel room that costs less than $95. Are they out there? I'm sure they are. Am I going to find one? No, I'm going to try to, I'm trying to find one for $500. Okay, moving on. <clears throat> We're going to get into some of the big boys now because this is where people that I talk to quite a bit, they can't understand. Rod, why do you pay all these annual fees? Because I know how to maximize the benefits and perks. I can't say I'm not minimizing the annual fee. I just know how to maximize the benefits and perks, and then it becomes a wash. Or my effective annual fee, which is what I pay an annual fee minus perks equal effective annual fee. So let me look here. And I see, Keaton, if I see your question, it just popped up on my screen. It's the last comment, but it is issued by Chase. Amex Gold Card. The Amex American Express Gold Card has a $250 annual fee. $250. Every, each of these cards I'm naming, I don't have a Delta Gold, but I do have the rest of them. $250 annual fee. Man, that's a lot of money. But I get $120 a year Uber credits, which guess how your boy got to downtown Dallas? I didn't drive. I called an Uber. It didn't cost me anything. It was more than 20 bucks or more than 10 bucks because you get 120 bucks, 10 bucks per month, 12 months, 120 bucks a year. Now they do expire each month. So if I don't use an Uber in this month, I lose it. Excuse me. I also get $120 annual food credit at Ruth Chris, at Cheesecake Factory, Shake Shack, Grubhub, Seamless, and somewhere else. 120 bucks. So I'm not a mathematician, but 120 times two or 120 for Uber, 120 for food, that's 240. My annual fee is 250. I get $240 back in perks. My effective annual fee, I'm paying 10 bucks a month for this car. I mean, a year, $10 a year. Would I, uh, why should I pay annual fee? Heck yeah, because I'm, I'm, who cares about 10 bucks? Now let's get to the big dog. And I think, uh, now I got one more before I get to it. Bank of America, I know me and uh, Marcus Hamilton, I think he's in here. He emailed me, uh, he was in the members only live stream last night. Bank of America Premium Rewards card. That card has a $95 annual fee, but I get a $100 uh, accidental airline, no, airline incidental fee every year, $100. So in, in all actuality, Bank of America is paying me $5 to carry this card, because I'm gonna use it. I, whether I upgrade my seat, whether I use for check bags, which I really don't need to use it for that. In the past, I've used it for uh, gift cards, for Delta. I don't think I did it for American. I'm gonna get my $100. So they're paying me, my effective annual fee on that card is negative five. Let me talk about the last one because I do want to jump down into these comments. American Express Platinum. This card costs me $550 per year. I hate paying it, but I have to think about it every time I pay it because I get a $200 Uber credit with the American Express Platinum card per year. I get $15 each month and $35 in December. I also get $200 airline incidental credit each year. I also get a $100 global entry, um, oh man, what, did, what, am I, what is the word I'm looking for? Credit every four years, and I also get $100 Saks Fifth Avenue credit every year. $50 uh, from January to June, $50 from July to December. So let's just take out this global entry credit. I get $200 for Uber, $200 airline incidental, $100 Saks, that's 500 bucks, $550 annual fee, my effective annual fee, I'm paying $50 for this car per year. So would I pay an annual fee? Why pay an annual fee 
You want a pair in your feet if you can justify. If you can't, don't do it. But if you can justify, if you can justify having the card and getting, so I'm not saying you're going to get, always get, I have a couple of cards. I have my Capital One Platinum uh, Venture card, not Platinum. I, it's a $95 annual fee. I really don't get $95. I do get $95 worth of value, but not in the form of perks. I just, I really don't, to be honest. Let me quit lying to myself. I don't. Um, I'm trying to think of another card. Uh, I have a couple other. The Barclays card, my business card, my aviator card. I just like the bonus on it. But with having the uh, American Airlines City card, I also have the, the business card. I also have the Barclays Aviator American Airlines business card. I really don't need both, and I probably will downsize. But that is the reason why I say pan annual fee. It really depends. It really depends on what you're doing and what you're accomplishing. All right, we got uh, a channel member in the house. We got Ulysses Hill in the crib. And if you have any more questions about annual fees or you have cards out there that you don't know how to maximize the annual fee, please let me know. Bring it up right now while we're in here. Throw it in the comments. More than likely, if I can't, I did see uh, Chase King in the house. If I don't know how to maximize it, there will be another viewer, subscriber, Somebody here should know how to maximize every card that's out there. Hey, what's going on, Ulysses? Ulysses says, I will be there. I'm assuming he meant the live stream. Ulysses says, hello, Rob. Welcome back. How are you doing tonight? I'm doing well, my man. Welcome back to another live stream, bro. We have, man, let me get here. We have another channel member in the crib. We have Mr. Paulo Alfonso in the house. Says, great juice on deck. Let's roll, baby. Hold up, man. That's not what I'm looking for. And there we go. And PBT family, don't forget to support our brother by becoming a channel member or purchasing merch. Let's go to the top. Yes, sir, I totally agree. Or Super Chats are in full effect. If you're looking for a good way to support the channel, Super Chats are in full effect. And it should be a little dollar sign thing somewhere down there by the, the subscribe button. It's somewhere I don't see because I'm using a different software than you guys are using. Thank you, Paulo, for that. We have another channel member in the crib. We do have Azuri Wayne says, hey, fam, what's going on? She got the thumbs up. And the bell rung. The doorbell is rung. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Hey, what's going on? Sean Robinson is in the house. Says, hi, Rod and PBT family. What's up, my man? How you doing? Hope you're having a great day. Hope everybody's having a great day. I know I've had a quick day. I'm, I'm telling you, my day flew by. And I really don't even know what all I did. I, I, I did accomplish something major today. I put it off, and I put it off, and I put it off. Uh, Wednesday, I can't do it on Sunday because it's, it's, it's something that has to be done Monday through Friday. And between shooting videos and live streams, I put it off for at least oh, six weeks, and I finally did it today. That's why I didn't shoot a video today, and the outcome was fabulous. I am so excited about that. Hey, we have another channel member in the crib. We got LVZD says, hello, Mr. PBT and family. Hey, if this is your first time here, let me know what, not, it's not LVZD's first time. Let me know what area you're coming from. I am broadcasting from the Dallas-Fort Worth area, Arlington, Texas, to be exact, home of the Dallas Cowboys. You're going to see acronyms in here. PBT is points blank travel in case this is your first time here. Good to see you, LVZD. Glad to have you back. We got another channel member in the crib. We have Marcus Hamilton in the house. Says, good afternoon, Rod and Credit Family. How everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Hey, uh, Marcus, hopefully you got that email. I answered your question. I know you emailed me maybe last night. And speaking of which, if y'all email me, it's not going to take 48 hours. But my disclaimer is give me at least 24 to 48 hours to respond because I don't have my email. I have several email accounts and I don't have notifications on. But I check my email several times a day. It just depends on what I have going on or how technical your question may be. So at least give me 24 to 48 hours to respond. We got Azuri, one thing you guys are gonna see if this is your first time here, you are gonna see a lot of love that's being shown throughout the room. Azuri says, hey, Mark is doing well here, how about yourself? Hey, we got a man that's been down with points blank travel, PB. I'm gonna go back to the points blank days. He's been down with me since the very beginning, and that is Mr. Mentor. Met him, virtually met him on uh, uh, K-College's channel. It's always a pleasure to see you, Mr. Mentor. I did see your other uh, uh, 
other comment where you said it was echoing, and, and I didn't know, I, I haven't, I think I did one last night, and I think I had it turned down a little bit more. I did one in the members on the live stream. I showed them in a different video, a different clip, whatever you want to call it. So I'll definitely keep that in mind. Hey, man, it's good to see you, bro. Marcus says, hey, Rod, I do have a question for Bank of America, pre-approved for credit cards. It does recommend credit card. It, if it does recommend credit card, does that mean you qualify for one? No, it does not. It does not. It is just telling you what they recommend. Pre-approve is what they, they pre-screen you. You may qualify for that card. Pre-approval does not mean you're automatically approved. No, it does not. Let me make sure that's clear with everybody. Just because they say you're pre-approved. Now, there's a good, sh a better shot, but it does, it's not automatic. So, uh, and I meant to put that in my email, Marcus. It does not mean that it's automatic. It does not mean you're going to be approved. So definitely keep that in mind. All right, Mr. Mentor says, no video or sound. I'm sure that was at the beginning. Uh, Marcus, show love back to Azuri. Let me get down here. All right, Mr. Mentor came back and said, sound good. Man, it's just good to see you, bro. How, how's everything been going, man? I know I, I miss you because Kate doesn't really do uh, live streams that much now. And I used to see you over there quite a bit. I've actually seen you in uh, Nigel's uh live stream so it was good seeing you there and I don't, I don't i can't remember if i hollered at you hey we got my main man speaking of nigel man this dude is putting in that work that serious work nigel schroeder is in the house nigel does have a youtube channel he has a couple of youtube channels but i want to focus on the one nigel schroeder check him out he can do one video a day and he might drop six videos in a day i wish i had the energy that this young man has because he's doing big things says what's up boss glad to have you in the building Nigel. It's always a pleasure to see you my man always hey we got my man man king nip and his lady erica in the crib says pbt points my travel my guy rob what's good how you doing man hope all is well with you yes sir all is well another wednesday was off today lost track of time somehow but i did accomplish something major 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 hey i see we got 16 people in the crib 11 people ring that doorbell and the doorbell is that like button down below make sure you snap smash that joint it helped the channel it helped the video get pushed out to people that may be looking for information like this please if you're looking for a, a free way to support the channel just hit the thumbs up that's all i ask pretty i really appreciate it all right uh man am i going backwards i do have a question if approved for one bank of america credit card what's a good time to apply for another car and is there a limit on how many credit cards from bank of america you can have yes uh marcus i will email you because i got to look at it i want to say it's, it could be two cards in a 30-day period or a 60-day period I, I i have to look at it but my question is my my, my comeback to this and, and y'all, I'm sometimes I just keep it super duper real, man. If, uh, if you don't have thick skin, you may not want to ask me a question, and not not at Marcus, because Marcus asks me a lot of questions, and I appreciate every one of them. But Marcus, what I would think about first and foremost, let's get that first card, bro. Let's get that first card. Yes, I look down the line. Yes, I look into the future. Yes, I think ahead. But let's get that first card. Let's. Let's say it's, you can get two cars every nine, every, every every three months. Let's put some spin on that first car. Let's build a relationship with that first car. Let's show Bank of America that we ain't playing and then come out with that second car or the third car. I want to say it's two cars in a 90-day period. I have three cars with them, and I know I space it out. I always space my stuff out. If I don't hit them right upside, and I'm not going to do two places at once. I might do three different uh, issuers in one month, but I don't, I don't. I, I, that's why I don't know it off the top of my head because I never do three American Express cards in 90 days or two Bank of America cards. I don't do it like that. I, I, I spread it out. So I will look it up and shoot you an email, though. Hey, Azuri says, hey, Rod, good to see you. Hey, it's good to see you, too. Azuri, glad to have you back in another live stream. Another channel member is in the house. I've already acknowledged you as a channel member. All right, King David Erica is showing my man, man, Nigel, some love. And I love it, man. I love the way that... We show respect. We show love in here. It is always a pleasure. First of all, I don't even know how Nigel found the time to be in my live stream because the man is busy. So it is a complete honor to have him here. Mr. Schroeder in the building. Yes, sir. Yes. And me and uh, Nigel, matter of fact, the last live stream I was in that he was having, we were talking about this collaboration. Uh, we did one on his channel 
few months back, man, it was emotional. It was, it was like Drumline. If you've seen the movie Drumline, it was old school. Your boy me meets new school. And if you remember the movie Drumline, when they, when Nick Cannon and and, and whoever else was in the movie, I don't even know their real names. When they they took it back with the old school music and they brought that new school in there, they won the the entire band contest or whatever. And that's what it was like when me and Nigel hooked up. So glad to have him back in the building. Paulo says, in my opinion, the best credit card benefits will always have an annual fee. Yes, sir, they will. You're you're not going to find you. Now, you can get some good redemption, some good earnings, like on the Freedom Flex, five, five times the points of 5% cash back on rotating categories. Uh, who else? The uh, Bank of America Cash Rewards card, no annual fee, 3% cash back. You choose one out of six categories. The uh, U.S. Bank, uh, what, man, Cash Plus card, no annual fee, 5% cash back on two out of 12 different categories, but when it comes to perks, you're gonna pay an annual fee for perks. They're not giving those away. <clears throat> and if you use it right, your perks outweigh the fee, but there's a, there's great annual fee cards out there, just my opinion. And I absolutely, totally 255% agree with you, Paulo, wholeheartedly. Oh man, y'all think I'm kidding, I swear that'd be the coldest water in history. Uh, make sure I got all my lights on. It seems like I'm missing something. All right, let me get on to these comments here. Mm -mm -mm. All right, Azuri is showing love to Nigel, man. We got that superstar up in the joint, man. And and that's where Mr. Mentor was saying echo, uh, lots of echo. Uh, love more. What's up, love more? Haven't seen you in a minute. Says PBT family, peace. We got the peace side of that. To look at these little, uh, especially when it's, 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 it's people of color, because they, they, they look a different shade with the way my my screen is set up. So I had to look down in there. Man, it is great to have you back in another Points Blank Travel live stream. I'm excited to have you here. Nigel says, What's up, Nip and Erica? Just showing love. What's up, Missouri? Driving home, man. You driving and typing, boy. You you a bad dude, man. Dude doing five six videos a day, driving and typing. Not just texting. He driving and typing during a live stream, man. You know Nigel, Nigel bad. Hey, we got my main man, Get Business Credit, Josh. What's going on, bro? Say what's good, bro. Hey, just chilling, man. Two live streams, second live stream, and and, and two days consecutive back to back. Did a members only live stream last night. Here for a regular live stream tonight. Make sure if you guys are looking for. Uh, business credit, if you're thinking about starting a business, and, and I'm not saying you have a business, if you're thinking about starting a business, you don't want to wait until you get a business to learn about how to get business credit. Start doing it now if you're thinking about it to see if it's for you, man. This dude dropped, he not know he dropped two videos uh, Monday. Definitely check out Josh. Get business credit, man. A great format. He does live streams as well. Please check him out. Matter of fact, I can't wait to go back to another one of his live streams because I got to reciprocate some of the love that he's shown to Points Blank Travel. All right. King Nip and Erica says, that makes sense, Rod. It does. It does. That's smart the way you summed up the baggage fee. That was hella smart and true. Hey, thanks so much, man. Yeah, dude. You know, when I first got into credit cards, I, I'll be honest, man, I was like the average person. A lot of this stuff I talk about, I, usually 99% of it that I talked about is because I experienced the other side. I didn't understand it in your field. I'm like, why am I going to pay somebody to have their credit card? That's crazy. I did it at first because I wanted credit, but after that, and I realized there was no annual fee card. I'm like, I don't want no card with no annual fee. But once I learned the game, once I became a master of my craft, and you guys will hear me say that a lot, once I became a master of my craft and understood how can I exceed the annual fees, it made it that much more interesting. If I got a, 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 a homeboy that I'm traveling with, or I got a lady that I'm traveling with, or me and my brother going somewhere, or I'm taking my, my grandson or my nieces and my nephews somewhere, and we're taking one trip, and, and let's say I got three of them and we're smart. We, 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 we got four. Let's just have four nieces, nephews, whatever. And we, we could it down to two bags just for all four kids' clothes and then my check bag. I'm still coming ahead. So, man, thank you so much, bro. Appreciate you, man. Okay, I already answered that earlier. King Nip said, who is the uh, world of higher card issued by? It is issued by Chase. Uh, it is part of the 524. It used to didn't be. 
but all, and now it is. So uh, not a hard card to get. You just have to be under the 524 rule. And the 524 rule is you can't be approved for more than five cards in a 24-month period. And hey, I apologize, man. One of my lights in here is, it's, it's, it's got that it's got that situation, man. One of my lights got the the pandemic is messing with it. <laughs> so uh, I did get my other my new lights uh, from Amazon today. I just haven't had time to hook them up. So the next live stream, the next video, I will be glowing. I know uh, one of the channel members last night, uh, uh, D Bernard, told me don't ch uh, don't shut down the grid with my with my uh, electricity because I'm about to be lit up up in here. So. Oh, all right. King Nip says, I have the uh, Amex Gold. Let's hear it. Yeah, man, that Amex Gold. Hopefully you got it, dude. You got the $120 Uber credits. That's new. It's only been out a couple months. You got $120 uh, food credit, man. It's $240 back. You're paying $250 on your fee. You're winning, baby. Hey, we got my main man, Chase King, another channel member in the crib. I gave Chase King props in my last video where I talked about uh, cryptocurrency and it's now the right time to think about crypto because Chase King schooled me and I, I am proud to say I learned crypto from him. D. Bernard was schooling me a little bit last night, another channel member, another subscriber. But Chase King was the one that put your boy on the map. I didn't know nothing about this. Didn't know how to invest, didn't even know where to get it, didn't even know which one to get. I mean, everybody heard of Bitcoin, but I didn't want Bitcoin. I can't afford Bitcoin. And, and matter of fact, hey, Chase, I bought some more Cardano and uh, 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 Stellar Lumens today, man. Bought some more today. And I, I'm Thanks to uh, uh, D. Bernard, I'm either going to get rich or go broke. I'm going to do one of them. I'm a GRGB. I'm going to get rich or go broke, man. But I'm putting my money. I'm not putting all my money. I never put all my eggs in one basket. I was that dude on Easter, man. Had like five baskets, yo. <laughs> let, me, let me quit tripping. All right. He said, what's up, Rod? Listening to you while I'm driving. Hope everyone in this room is having a good night. Yes, sir. Good to see you, my man. Hey, I got to chop it up with you, though. I got to tell you what I got going on. <clears throat> Chase says, sorry, I won't be able to answer anyone since I'm driving. Y'all can still sell uh, Chase came some love. I'll read it out. If, if anybody's saying what's up to him, I'll read it. He, he, at least he can hear it uh, and we understand. Uh, King Nip and Erica. Uh, it's King Nip. I know Erica ain't saying this. Now, she, she's there and down with King Nip, but this is King Nip saying, Oh, beep. I got to use my Uber credit. I got two days left. Thanks for the reminder. Ain't no problem, man. I, I, I'd probably use mine six seven months out of the year i don't use it all 12 months but when i do i do i use it all up hey we got nino in the crib nino let me let me let me look here let me see nah. had to check something he says buenas noches senor what's up my man doing a staycation this week doing home improvement painting etc been busy but not too busy to hit you up a minute man i appreciate that i mean a lot my man upgrading his crib doing some home improvement he painted and he still took a moment to tune in to points blank travel man that, that's love right there yo that is love and i really appreciate it from the bottom of my heart good to see you neo hey we got jonathan factor in the crib let me make sure i'm, I'm looking over here man y'all want to probably what i'm looking i'm making sure because i had these members memorize uh these channel members memorized but i want to make sure i don't miss them hi there from south orange new jersey what do you think about a primary a primary what <laughs> elaborate jonathan a primary trade line a primary what i want to, i don't want to answer the wrong question so what do i think about a primary what and hey sorry about the i know the lighting is going dull and, and not dull and, and dark and light it's because i'm wearing a hat matter, matter of fact and I, I, matter of fact, these new lights I'm about to hook up, that's going to alleviate all that mess because I'm about to be glowing. <laughs> I'm going to be tripping. I'm about to be glowing in the spotlight. All right. Let me go back up here. Nigel says, I'm still with you. Reroll it. And I ain't forgot about you. Okay, man. Cool. I know, dude. I know you're busy. And I've been busy. Like, like I don't even know where the time went today. I, I know what I did. I accomplished something major today, Nigel. I got to tell you about it, man. I, I, I'll give you a call maybe after this live stream. I got to tell you about it. It was, dude, it was huge. It was huge. It had nothing to do with no YouTube, nothing to do with Points Blade Travel. It was just huge. 
you know, I, I didn't partner up with Elon Musk or nothing like that. It was just huge, though. I'm just telling you, it was huge. Uh, yeah, I got some Cosmos, Nigel. I, was, I, I have some Cosmos. I just didn't name them. I, didn't, I don't think I mentioned them in my video. I, it was like four coins that I have that I didn't even mention in the video because I didn't want it to be too lengthy. Uh, we got another channel member in the crew. We do have Ronald Anderson in the house says, what's up at Points Blank Travel? Driving, man. You're back on that road, man. I hope you're feeling better. I've been meaning to reach out to you. Uh, I know you had a, a situation earlier in the month, man. Glad to see you back out there. It looked like you got a routine back down. It's good to see you uh, tune in to another live stream, man. It's always a pleasure to see you and hear from you. Hey, we got my main man, Tim Williams, in the crib. What's going on, Tim? Says, I don't pay your fees. They pay me. That's woo-hoo. Hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute, man. You know what? Tim, man, dude, you should have you, you hit me up and let me use that line, man. Tim came up with a... Tim came up with a line. Hold up here, man. I got my... I'm trying to change some stuff on my macbook pro here all right man tim said i don't pay on your fees they pay me and that's <laughs> hold up man let me pull out my, my 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 boy i i could drop the mic on that one <laughs> i mean i don't even have a cut i i'm quick with the tongue i'm i'm quick like this man and i i don't even have a comeback on that that's what i'm talking about the man said he don't pay any fees, and your and your fees pay him. Tim, man, I hope all is well. I ain't even got to say that because, uh, all right, so uh, what do you think about a primary trade line? I, elaborate a little more. I mean, I, uh, uh, Jonathan, you got to you gotta be a little more specific. I mean, primary trade lines can be good. It depends on what you're talking about. So be a little more specific, and I'd be more than happy to address that. And if I don't, you have people like uh, – Nigel, who's in here, he may have an opinion on it, and I have no issue with that. Yes, sir, Tim Williams says winning. Yes, sir, we're winning, baby. We're always winning, man. We got 19 people in the crib, 15 people ringing that doorbell. Uh, boy, this light, I, I'm telling you, I feel, I'm looking at my cameraman, and I feel like I'm in one of those, uh, I, I said it in the members only last night, a solar eclipse where it's bright over here and dark over here, and let me see something. Let me see what this makeup there is here. Oh, heck no. I look like a little black dot. Damn, y'all can't even see me. I'm over here tripping. No, we, I'm just going to live with it, baby, one more day. Hey, we do have another YouTuber in the crib. We have work to live, not live to work. We got Felicia in the house. She says, hey, Rod and PBT fam, I'm just catching up on the live. That was some great information on how to maximize those annual fees. Thank you so much, Felicia. I really appreciate it. Man, and before I read the rest of her comment, do me a favor, y'all. If you want to learn about saving money, you know, I'm telling you how to take your annual fees and maximize the, the perks and the benefits. But if you want to save money in the form of couponing, like I'm not extreme couponing. I'm trying to learn how to baby coupon. But if you want to take it to that next level and learn how to take it to that next level, definitely check out work to live not live to work she uh she typically does live streams on friday at 8 30 eastern standard time 7 30 pacific i mean i'm thinking about cali central standard time and it's a load of uh, information i have several subscribers from this channel i know your favorite couple goes there miss pular goes there uh i've seen a couple other people I, I can't remember everybody off the top of my head so definitely 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 uh Definitely check that out. All right. So which annual fee card would be the best to start with? I would say, uh, let's see. Let's see. I was working on a video, Felicia, and I was working on the content. Uh, uh, And I, I stopped the video, I stopped the content because I disagree with what I would, I, I, I agree, but I, I don't agree. I would say the best annual fee to car to start with, and it's not cashback, it's gonna be in the form of points or miles. It would either be an airline card, depending on your hub city, whether you're in a United hub, a American hub, a Delta hub, a JetBlue hub, Alaskan hub, or it could be a hotel card. 
that's, I'm gonna put that over to the left. All of those are gonna be about 95 to $99. I would look at two cars. Now this article and the content I was working on was talking about the Chase Sapphire Preferred. $95 annual fee. You have several transfer partners. It is a transferable points program in the form of Chase Ultimate Rewards. I would also think about the American Express Everyday Preferred car. Both of those cars are $99 annual fees. American Express Everyday Preferred will give you access to the American Express Membership Rewards Program. Chase Sapphire Preferred will give you access to the uh, Chase Ultimate Rewards Program. I like having transfer points because I'm not locked down to a, a airline card or a hotel card. So first, I would either look at A, Chase Sapphire Preferred, or B, and there's not an A or B. A1, Chase Sapphire Preferred, A2, American Express Everyday Preferred. I would look at those two as far as starting with. That's just my opinion. <coughs> well, hey, Jonathan, if you're talking about primary trade lines on credit card, I don't do them. Uh, it may be someone else in here that does it. I don't. Uh, it's just me. Uh, um, I, I, I really don't provide this service. Again, it may be somebody else. Uh, yes, Ulysses, my lights did come today. They're in a box across from me right now. I haven't even had time to open up the box. Uh, I hate putting stuff together. I'm going to be honest with you. I, I absolutely have. I may take it to work tomorrow and, and try to coerce somebody into helping me put it together. Put it together for me. I hate putting stuff together. Uh, so yes, it did come today. Nigel says, and leverage them for bank cards. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Make sure y'all check out Nigel Schroeder's channel. Why does a secure charge an annual fee? Well, a lot of times, uh, Hector, Hector, this is the first time I've seen you here, Hector. Do me a favor. Let me know what area you represent. Again, I am broadcasting from the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Uh, you don't have to say the city. You can say the state. You're not comfortable with that. Just say the region, south, midwest, east coast, west coast, northwest, whatever. Um, a lot of secured cards will charge an annual fee because they know you're in a predicament or it used to be where you're in a predicament and you don't have, you didn't have other options. So yes, they're gonna charge you an annual fee because you have to start somewhere. And typically you would start with a secure card, but there are secure cards out there right now. Discover it secure card, Bank of America secure cash rewards card. Uh, US Bank has a Harley Davidson card. There's so many different secure cards out there now that does not charge an annual fee. If you pay for a secure card, an uh, annual fee for a secure card right now, don't beat yourself up because you're learning. We're all learning. But let it be known. If you're one, I'm that person that paid an annual fee for a secure card. I am. So instead of getting mad, what am I doing now? I'm teaching others how not to follow the path that I went down, not follow the road that I went down. So, uh, Hector, if you end up paying or if you're thinking about it, please look at some of the other cards. Hit me up at points blank travel points with an S points blank travel at gmail.com. I can tell you what I think the best secure cards are that does not have an annual fee. Let me know. Uh, and I think I see down here, uh, Hector. And also, Hector, if you haven't done so already, do me a favor, man. Subscribe to the channel. This is only the beginning, bro. This, you know, we. You, we, we, we dropping boulders here, baby. I don't drop gems. I don't drop nuggets. That's a little small for me. I like to drop boulders. I like to hit people upside the head with knowledge, if you feel what I'm saying. So, all right, where was I at here? Uh, Sean says, I just read on Google News that banks will offer credit cards to people without credit scores as early as this fall. You know, it's funny you mention that because, and I got to give a shout out to uh, Ulysses, one of my channel members, and he's in the stream. He sent me an article a couple weeks ago. I would have been early with the news. I just hadn't had time to get more information. Uh, and I think I saw a couple of credit card YouTubers do a video on this. But yes, uh, it, it just, they're still in the early stages. That's why I didn't want to drop a, vid a video. But Chase, I want to say Wells Fargo and somebody else. I don't know if it was Bank of America. It was your major banks. They're talking about uh, offering credit cards to people without credit scores. But I think from what I gathered, and that's why I haven't done a video, because it was kind of all over the place willy-nilly with the information, it seemed like it was going to be more for people that um, are students or, or, or immigrants or something of that nature. It's not going to be for the dude that's 32 and 
just decided he didn't want to get no credit. And it may be, but it was kind of vague. So I got to read a little more uh, about that. I definitely want to look a little more into that. All right. Nigel says, some banks will, they have done this before. It will be temporary. Take advantage. Yes. And I think you hit that up, Nigel. I think I saw one of your videos where you said it was going to be a temporary thing. Uh, and Nigel may have more information than I did. Like I said, I saw uh, the article. I read the article. Ulysses sent me. I saw a couple other articles. But it was just, it, it was kind of still kind of vague. I, I couldn't get the specifics in. I'm, I'm going to do a video. I want to have the specifics. Uh, I want to have all the details. I want to do my research. I want to know what I'm talking about. I don't like to say, well, it could be this. It could be that. When I'm doing a video. Live stream, when I'm answering questions, it could be a little different. But when I do a video and there's no interaction and all you got to go by is what I'm saying, I like to have for real 200% information. So, all right, Hector says I'm from New York City, man. I ain't going to even, I, I was going to say which borough, but then I'm just dwelling down. I, I was in New York in 2019. Oh, man, I flew in uh, LaGuardia. I don't know which borough that is. And I went to, I stayed in Midtown, uh, Manhattan. Uh, 34th and 7th, and I went over to Harlem, I went to Bronx, I was all over the place, but I loved it out there, man. Loved it out there. All right, I'm going to skip down, I got to remember where I am real quick. Uh, let me jump over here. I'd like to take the time, man, I got to get over there, and I want to take the time to thank my man, man, Josh, from Give Business Credit Super, super chat. chat for that twenty dollars super chat, dude. I gotta man. Let me know when you're going live again, dude. I, man, I'm a, I'm gonna have to just just camp out in your live stream because I'm telling you, man. Josh has been showing points man travel a lot of love again, man. Please, if you're thinking about starting a business, and I'm not saying this, I said it before. I've said it three times before. We even did a super chat. Check him out, man. He's putting out information that uh, and I, Nigel, I don't know if you checked him out. But uh, definitely, uh, uh, oh, I see, I see you, King Nip. I'm gonna answer your question. Give me one second. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna. Uh, I think I have a link in my thing here. I'm gonna have to do some, and I, I can get that. Uh, put it on the screen. I can put the link there. But yeah, man, please y'all check him out, Nigel. I don't know if you've had a chance to check him out, but definitely check out my main man, Josh. And what was I at here? Uh, K. Nip says, oh, beep, me too, laugh out loud. Hey, Tim McCall, I'm from NYC. Yeah, man, the next time I go to NYC, I talked to K. Nip on the phone, and before I even talked to him, he put he, he put it in a comment, N-A-H mean. I'm like, man, I, I looked at it, I'm like, nah, you know, I, I don't even know if I can say it right now, I mean, you know, but I knew immediately he was from New York, and, and whenever I go back to New York, you best be, I'm going to look K. Nip up, man. I, I don't care where he is, I'm going to find him. I was all on the subways, and uh, where, what else did I do? I I didn't take no helicopters or nothing when I was up there, but I was on the subways. Um, man, I had a good time. Let me let me let me try to find this real quick because King Nip X is gonna make me little here. I'm not sharing my screen just yet. Let me go here because I want to see King Nip is asking me how to become a channel member, and you know your boy like to. I think I have a link to it. Hmm. <sighs> no, and I'm not going to spend a lot of time doing this. I'm going to look through. If not, uh, King Nip, I can get it to you. I can text it to you. But if you go to my homepage, uh, let me go down here. I'm going to go down a couple more. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Edit, copy. This is going to take me away, but I'll be able to get back because it's not that much, King V. There you go, King Nip. I just put it in the uh, comments. If you want to become a channel member, the link is right there. Uh, and if that doesn't work, man, text me and I'll text you the link. I'm pretty sure that will, though. Man, I'm over here playing hide and seek with my dang on. My comments cursor. I swear it drive me nuts. Let me see here. There we go. Oh, man, it moved and it went away. 
I know y'all, man, I, I wonder what it looked like on the other end because I swear I'm always chasing these things. There it go. It was there and I couldn't get to it. There we go. All right. Let me scroll up. Hey, we got John T in the crib. John, I haven't seen you in a while. Sorry, it got dark, man. I'm, once I'm away from my camera so long, it changes the lighting. There it goes. Greetings from Iowa. What's up, John T? I haven't seen you in a minute, man. How you been? I hope all is well, man, over in Iowa. Uh, is it cold out there? Is it hot out there? I don't know. I ain't never been there. I don't know nothing about Iowa, man. I, I've never been there. Not said I, I won't ever go, but I, I just never been there, man. But it's always good to see you. Let me know I'm stretching out across the country. King Nip says, Rod, and Erica says, Rod, how do I get the channel member? <laughs> I'm going to leave it at that. Hey, I just, I just, I just put it down there, Kate Nip, man. The link is down there. If you do uh, leave the stream and go over there and become a member, make sure you come right back because it'll, it'll let me know. It, I'll get a little thing to pop up and then it'll give me a chance. Let me see here. New, New channel, channel member. Yeah, I had to make sure that still works. So, yeah, I just said it. I put it down there, Kate Nip. Let me know if you got it, my man. All right, Hector says the thing is that the ones without the your feet are the ones we cannot get approved. But why? No, 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 Hector, that's 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 not true, man. A secure card typically is going to be backed by your own collateral. It's going to be backed by uh, two to five hundred dollar security deposit that you're going to put down. It's so I'm not going to say it's not a possibility you won't be approved for a secure card. That is a possibility. But it's too many options out there, man. And if you subscribe to the channel and check out my videos, you're going to always hear me say options. I believe in having options. There are too many options out there for you not to be able to get approved for at least one of these no annual fee secure cards. Hit me up at Points Blank Travel, man. Points Blank Travel at gmail.com. I want to... Hold up, man. Some fly around. If you're tripping, dude. Hey, Ulysses, I should have my lights already on, man, because something just flew by me. I hope, I think, oh man, I think it's a fly out, boy. I gotta, I gotta get, we might have to take a commercial break. If it fly by me one more time, I have to pause everything to get that out of here. Yes, Ulysses, they are LED lights. Yes, sir. These aren't the ones I got right now, or the, I'm just getting started on YouTube lights. But the ones I got coming in, I got the uh, uh, LED lights. I got two of those, and then I got the, this other thing I'm thinking about ordering, got a big shade around it. Just depend on who I'm broadcasting. I'm telling y'all, I might be outside one night, man. Especially as it start to warm up. I might be outside shooting outside at night. I'm gonna be out there like, you're gonna think I'm in uh All I need is one of them uh, look like moon cars where the producer had a, the camera and they be rolling back and forth. <laughs> That's all I need. Your boy, I'm, I'm gonna be all over the place. All right, get busy, Craig. Rod, I don't have set days. I do live stream likely. We'll do one tomorrow. Evening. Okay, I will. Well, tomorrow evening, yes, I will be there. I'm, I get off early. Even if I work late, I'll be there tomorrow. Uh, make sure y'all subscribe to Get Business Credit if you want to check out a different perspective, a, a business perspective, and a different live stream. I've been to two of his live streams. I want to say one, or I know one. And man, I learned a lot, a whole lot in a short period of time. Hey, we got another couple YouTubers in here. We got Shelton and Key in the house. Says, good evening, PPT family and creative family. Great member live last night. Thank you so much. Make sure you guys do me a favor. Check out your favorite couple. I'm going to read that comment again. Make sure y'all check out your favorite couple, man. I, I try not to say it because I confused uh, one of my viewers and a subscriber. I had them look, and I, you know, I tell this story, but I don't remember who it was. But I had them searching YouTube for my favorite couple because I always say they are my favorite couple, man. The love that they have, the camaraderie that they have, the tightness that they have. the I, I love it because <laughs> it just tripped me out when I watched their videos. And it seemed like one in every three videos, man. Key about to smack Shelton upside the head. <laughs> I just love it, man. I love it. They are in the Dallas Fort Worth area too, man. I love it. And uh, just so y'all know, Shelton Key, I kind of got over some of my paranoia this past weekend. Man, I was in Deep Ellum, uh, Addison, Plano, Dallas. Uh, I think that was it. I think that was all of my tour, man. I was all over the place. I know Sunday we hit uh, Vanetti's. Oh, man, we hit uh, the Freeman and Deep Ellum. We hit like four different spots. 
And I, I forgot all about the current situation, man. I was like, I'm free at last. I'm back out. Y'all are back out. But anyway, uh, definitely got to link up with y'all, man. I think I'm, I'm slowly getting over this, this paranoia about being out. Uh, but uh, your favorite cover this says, uh, good evening, PBTA. Uh, good evening, PPT family and credit family. Great members live last night. There was a members only live stream last night. I think it was about an hour and 20 minutes, hour and 15 minutes. Uh, behind the scenes stuff, I showed other footage of me being out this past weekend. Um, talked about a couple different things, probably about three different subjects. So a lot of fun there. I always like doing those. Uh, Hey, my man, Josh says, got to show PBT some love. And I appreciate it, bro. But I got to come back and show uh, GBC. And I, I, I do see in your stuff, I, I think I saw it in your live show. I got to show GBC some love as well, man. So I appreciate it, man. Hey, iron sharpens iron, bro. So we're we going to be showing each other love. All right, Nigel Schroeder. There we go. Just subscribe to get business credit. If you say they're family, they're family. That's what I'm talking about. That word is bud now. And I like how Nigel, and the same thing with me. If Nigel tell me, hey, Rod, this person cool. Rod, this person's good. If, if Nigel say they're family, they're family. And just like what he just said, if you say they're family, they're family. And I, I'm telling y'all right now, Josh at GBC or get business credit is family. So there you have it. Coming from the Rod father. <laughs> I like that the rod father. I ain't never used as long as I've been living, I ain't never used that. Man, should have had that in my repertoire this weekend. The rod father. <laughs> oh, hey, don't y'all start calling me. I don't even know why I said that. Thanks, Nigel. Oh man. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. And in case you, I'll leave it up there for a minute. Uh, I don't know, uh, K. Nip, and I just said I just said I put that up there. And hey, K. Nip, let me let me. Uh, I won't text. I I I get it to you after this live stream. I have your number. I'll get it to you. Or go here, man. Let me let me try something. Else. If you don't, uh, let me see something. Here, y'all bear with me real quick. Let me go to my channel. Uh, man, I got all kind of stuff going on here. Share. Yeah, I just sent you the YouTube channel, King Nip. If you go down there right beside where it says subscribe, <coughs> yours is going to show subscribed because you already subscribed. Right to the left of that, it's going to say join, and that's where you join the channel membership. I'm not sure if it's not working because you're on the phone. All right, that link didn't work. Well, I just sent you a, I just sent you one to your phone, so that should work. Let me know if it worked, King Nip, before I get out of here, man. Let me know. And it could be because you're on the phone. I'm not quite sure, but it, it's, uh, I don't know, because I've never tried it, whether I was off the phone, off the phone. But if you go to my home page, try the link I just sent you. I just sent you a link to my home page. Right beside subscribe, there is a link that says join. If that don't work, let me know. And I'll hit you up right after this live stream. John T says, we get all four seasons, which is great. Right now, it has range from 50 to 80-ish. Wow, that's a big range. I live for that fall weather when it's 40 to 60 and sunny. Yeah, I live for that, uh, and it was 93 today in Dallas. Arlington, actually. I wasn't in Dallas, which is 30 minutes away. Same temp. Your boy was hot. I got to go find my shorts, man. I got to go find all my shorts. I, I, they're in one of my drawers. I, it's a couple of my dresser drawers. I don't even go in two half the year, so... Uh, Uh, Ulysses, you said send me his link, links, please. What links, Ulysses? Uh, get business credit. I don't have any links for get business credit. All you have to do is go to, if that's what you're talking about, I'm not even sure what you're talking about. Uh, that's the only thing I can think of what you're talking about. The links, for him, you just have to go to, it's the same thing and anything else on YouTube. Go to 
Um, YouTube, search, get business credit, and it'll pop up. If you're talking about something else, let me know, though. Hey, what's going on, Trent? Man, I haven't seen you in a while. We got Trent Clark in the crib. Trent says, what's up, PBT? How are you doing? Question, still trying to break into the 700s. And he's talking about his credit, credit score. Only thing holding me back is one charge off from one year ago. Should I hire a credit repair place to fix this? Their charge of, no, nope, <laughs> nope. Wait, 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 hold up, hold up. You, you know, I'm quick to say no. How... How about this? How about I charge you two fifty? No, I'm kidding, man. I'm kidding. I'm kidding, Trent. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. How close are you to seven hundred? How? That's the question. Because if you're at six eighty, that one charge, it's got to be a way to get around it, and it could be time. But, huh? Two things. First of all, how close are you to seven hundred? That's number one. Number two. Why not keep your five hundred fifty dollars and contact the people who have the charge off and try to get a pay for delete letter? Meaning you pay them, they delete it off your credit. But before you go do that, let me know how close you are to seven hundred. That's that's the key. That's the that's the main question. But no, last option is paying five hundred fifty dollars for a credit repair. I'm not saying credit repair. It's, it could be cool. I never did it. I just rolled away, baby. I was on a surfboard riding a 500 credit score club for, I'm not saying do that, man. That's just what I did. Don't do that. Uh, what I did ride a surfboard, it was not nearly the technology that's out here today. And there's a lot of technology where you don't have to pay $550 uh, for a credit score. So, I mean, for credit repair. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it, man. I just saw Nigel's coming. I got to get back up here, man. He's coming, shooting through here. Uh, <laughs> I knew it. Hey, Nigel, as soon as I said it, I was like, oh, no. Why did I say that, man? Yeah, baby, the ride father. That's going to be it. Oh, man. Oh, boy, man. I have so much fun with y'all, man. Y'all have no idea. We got 27 people in the crib, 22 people ringing the doorbell. We got uh, several YouTubers in the house. We do have Get Business Credit, who's very knowledgeable on business credit, uh, how to get started with business credit. In addition, we don't have, I haven't seen him in the house. We also have my main man, Cakeology. He does business credit as well. We have Nigel Schroeder. Nigel has a YouTube channel. He's dropping I'd say two to six videos per day. Don't hold them to six, but you never know. And it's all knowledge, man. Knowledge is power. Knowledge is king. We also have your favorite couple in the house. Check them out. They do vlogs. They're invading cities across America, man. They're invading Kansas City, New York City, uh, Iowa City. They're invading any city. No, I don't know about Iowa City, but uh, we also have Work to Live, Not Live to Work in the house. Make sure you check her out. She is an extreme couponer. So we got all type of YouTubers in the house tonight. And then you got the master of ceremonies. Your main man, my boy, me, points blank travel, Rod, in the crib. So we gonna get back down into this here. Hey, we got my main man, S House, in the house. And I like S House. You know, people call me Points Blank Travel. They call me PBT. They call me Rod. My boy Kate called me PB for Points Blank. And then S House came with his own twist. What's up, Points? You know, it, it reminds me, you know, when I be out at some time, every blue moon. Not so much now, but it'll be these young cat roll up to me like, hey, what's up, school? And first time they have like, what's up, school? What you, what you talking about, dude? And I didn't know it was short for old school. You're like, yeah, what's up, school? That would remind me of how Like, what's up, points? Hey, what's up, man? It's always good to see you in the crib, bro. Woo, man. This here number, Credit and Comedy, baby. Credit and Comedy. Points Blank Live. Points Blank Travel Live is Credit and Comedy. We're going to have a whole lot of fun. We're going to do a whole lot of learning. And the day we can't do both, your boy going to retire from YouTube. So I don't plan on retiring no time soon. So we got to learn a little bit. We got to have a little bit of fun. It's just that simple. All right. Hey, Joe, man, don't apologize. You was at church. He says, sorry. Joe is a channel member, by the way. Joe Forth is a channel member. Always a pleasure to see him in the live stream. He says, sorry, I'm late. I have to catch you on the replay. Catch the replay, but, man, don't, don't apologize for being late if you was at church, dude. That's priority. Big priority. So glad to have you here, Joe. All right, uh, get business credit. Josh says, thank you, Josh. I subscribed to you while, uh, a while back. Good content you put out. Thanks, man. I'm telling you, dude, my main man, uh, Josh is supporting everybody. Please, man, make sure y'all show Josh some love. Show me some love. 
and check out his channel. That's all I ask. Hey, we got another channel member in the crib. We have my main man, Mr. Dion Jefferson in the house. I was finna say, Dion, it's funny you said glad to be back because I was worried about you, bro. And I, I know, I, I think I have your number. If I was that worried, I should have called you, huh? I knew you was all right, man. Dion is serving our country, man. And, uh, uh, he says, glad to be back. Been super busy with work, getting ready for a major inspection for the last few months, Rod. I got a lot of catching up to do with PBT. We'll be in touch. Yeah, man. Hit me up, dude. Uh, I, I don't know. I know how those inspections are in, in the Navy. I know how they can be. I know how in, in, intense they can be, how important they can be, especially for promotion sometimes. So, you know, appreciate what you do, man. I don't have a, I, we don't salute inside in the Navy, but my, I got to salute you, bro. Um, I appreciate what you're doing, man. If it's anything you need, bro, you know you always can reach out to me. You have my number. Any advice you need, I did retire as an E-8, uh, a senior chief head officer in the Navy. So you can only go to E-9. I'm not too my own horn. I'm just blowing that sun. Woo, I had to catch myself, boy. <laughs> but it, it's, it's kind of tough to get that high. So anything you need, my man, let me know. Please, please. Good to see you, Dion. While I'm trying to find my comments cursor here, it's good to see you, bro. Good to see you. And yeah, definitely catch up too, Dion. Catch up on them video, man. Hey, no, man. You know what? Uh, Nigel, I'm not on Clubhouse. Uh, I think you sent me some. I need you to send it again. The, it's funny, man. The first person that told me about Clubhouse was my boy DeJoy's wife who was down here this weekend. Well, she was here as well. And she told me months ago, before it even before I saw it anywhere, she she hit me up. Well, he hit me up. And he was like, man, she got something to tell you. And I was like, okay, what's up? And she was like, man, you ever have you heard of Clubhouse? I'm like, nah. And this, it, matter of fact, Nigel, this was before I was even monetized. I was trying to get monetized, and I told her that was my focus. So, hey, shoot me some info on that, man. Send me a link or something, bro. Uh, Ulysses said, yes, to get business credit. I tried, but it did not show up. Uh, hey, uh, uh, Josh, if you're still in here, man, can you put the link to your channel? Can you share the link to your channel in the comments, please, if you're still in here? <coughs> Excuse me. Uh Okay, I see you already uh, acknowledged it. All right, Nigel says, thanks to business credit. Trenton says, oh, 50, okay, so you're at a 650. Even that one charge off, uh, Trenton, and that's why I asked, that one charge off may or may not. Uh, and, and, and Josh, if you're in here, tell me what your opinion. I'd love to hear your opinion. Nigel, I'd love to hear your opinion. Uh, uh, Chase King, if you're still in here, I'd love to hear your opinion. But I don't think that one charge off. Especially if it was a year ago, you just got it. I don't, I don't know if that's going to take you up 50 points. It may take you up 20 points, 18 points, 25 points. I don't, I'm not sure it'll take you up 50. Would I pay 550 but not to guarantee that I'm going to go up 50 points? Probably not. That's just me, though. That's just me. That's... All right, get pissed and credit says, no problem. Uh, Yeah, yeah. Nino says, keep that 500, Clark. Forget about it. Yeah, man. That's what I'm saying, Nino. Thank you so much for co-signing, bro. I mean, these really, man. I mean, you can spend five fifty, yo, and, and and it may take your credit score up, but it's no guarantee it's gonna go up. And that's why I wanted to know how far away were you. All right, get business credit says that hey, Ulysses. If you search, get okay. That's him talking to Ulysses, and that's what I was saying. Oh man, <laughs> hey Nino, man, uh, boy, I wish I'd have knew all of y'all. And I think I when was there, man? August. I didn't start my channel until October. When did I get monetized? What is this, 21? I didn't start my channel until October 2019. I went to New York in August 2019 for my birthday. And man, we have a red carpet for Mr. Rod in New York City. Man, y'all can just say Rod, dude, but I appreciate the respect, Mr. Rod. And I can't wait to go back. Matter of fact, hey, I don't know if Shelton's still on here, but I got to pull out my spiral code. I'm about to write down. I got King Nip. Here, let me, uh, yeah. No, uh, yeah, I'm going to put it right here. I got King Nip. I got Nino. Uh, Nino. I'm right now all my New York family. So when I go there, I'm going to make sure I got y'all numbers, man. I, I, need, I like to have somebody know the city. I was talking to, uh, Someone today, I like. I need somebody to know the city. I I don't like getting caught up in them tourist traps. I want to know the city, man. I want to do. I like. I want. I was on the subway. 
I ain't got time to be riding on that little tour bus to going around. I want to be on the sub. I want to be with the people, man. <laughs> anyway, that means a lot, Nino. Thank you, man. The red carpet is out for your boy in NYC. All right, let's see here. And, hey, y'all bear with me, man. Let me, I, I don't know why I do this every time. I got my, my door open from when I, uh, from when I, let me pull up my pan, from when I uh, started this. Because it was daylight, now it's dark, and I feel like somebody's watching me. So, <laughs> I'm back. All right. Uh, oh, man, I didn't tell this group here. I told the members last night. My, my beloved chair, man, this chair that I've shot every video in, it collapsed on me yesterday, man. I'm, I, I, I almost needed one of those med alert, medical alert devices because uh, I, I had fallen and I couldn't get up. And I ain't being funny, man. I, mean, I, I, I knew it was about to give out, yo. And I was sitting down ever so gingerly, right? And yesterday I was half asleep, woke up, I was trying to edit, publish this video. Was it yesterday? Day before? I don't remember when it was. Anyway, it was a couple of days. I sat out, I flopped out in it and, and crashed, man. I didn't I, I didn't throw it away, man. I put it over there in the corner because I gotta get it fixed, man. That's my throne. That's the, I've shot every video with the exception. The only videos I haven't shot in that chair is when I shoot on my side. And uh, man, I feel I, I, I got this I got this brother, but it doesn't have any uh what do you call it armrests. I tried it last night and I guess I could do this, man. But then I look like I'm yeah, yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. That's something else. Anyway. Uh, <clears throat> S House is laughing when I said they called me school, and I was wondering what the hell they was talking about. Mikey T says, "What's up, Mikey T, my man? Man, how you doing, boss?" Says Rod, "Good to check in, my friend. Who I coach with is talking crazy. Okay, he's talking crazy. He wants to sign up for cards, hit the bonus, then cancel the card instead of a product change. I'm trying to drop some knowledge. Hey, man." Sometimes it's hard to pe it's hard to drop knowledge people on people might teach, especially people you know, because they don't want to admit you're right. You got a couple choices, man. You can keep trying to drop that knowledge. We can tag team, uh, tell them about the channel, man. Uh, or tell them not just my channel. Tell them about my channel, Dwayne's channel, Nigel's channel. And then when you see several brothers, and who knows, he may not be a brother. I don't care what color he is. It don't matter. Tell them about Get Business Credits channel. And he, after he sees so many people saying the same thing, a lot of times, man, he may not never tell you you were right, but he'll he'll listen, and then he might wait. He might wait five years from now when y'all playing dominoes or spades or just sitting up chilling. Hey, man, remember back in the day, Mikey, you told me about that, man. I ain't want to admit it, but I listened to you, dog. You know how we do it, man. But yeah, keep trying to drop that knowledge on him, bro. Please, please keep trying to drop that knowledge on him. Hey, we got Mr. Andrew2800 in the crib. Hey, what's up, Mr. Andrew2800? Hope you're having a great day. He says, what's up, PBT? Do Hilton points expire? There are several credit card points that will expire. I'd have to go and double check Hilton. What I do with my, I don't know if you have a card, Mr. Andrew2800, uh, but if you have a card, as long as you accumulate points each month, those points will renew. Now, I can tell you right now, I'll give you an example, and I know you're not asking, I'm just giving an example. My American Airlines, like Delta points don't expire, Southwest change, and we're not talking about airlines, we're talking about hotels. Um, and the reason I don't really know right off the top of my head, as a matter of fact, man, I, I don't like that. I'm gonna, I gotta answer this now. That's just, that's gonna bug me. Uh, but I know I have to use my American Airlines. I think they're good for 12, 18 months. If I don't use them, I lose them. But I use my card uh, every month, my uh, American cards. Uh, hold on. Do Hilton Honors. There we go. Uh, yes, and that's kind of what I was saying. If your account does not have any activity in a 15-month period, a 15-month period, your... Uh, well, let me make sure I'm reading this right because it looks like it's got two different time frames. Yeah, it's 15 months. If you don't use those points or, or have some type of activity, you don't have to use the points. And uh, activity is, uh, Mr. Andrew, activity is uh, standard of Hilton earning points. If you don't have a card or, or accumulating points on your card, you have to have some type of activity in that account in a 15 month period or yes, they will expire. Glad I looked it up, man. I feel, feel good about myself.
Uh, hey, uh, hey, K Nip, did you get that link I sent you? Uh, I texted to you. I sent you a text, so you should have that. Oh, man. About how to become a member. Hmm, let's see here. Where was I at? Where was I at? Uh, matter of fact, King Nip, I don't know if you're still in here or not. Let me look for something here. Let me. Let me log. Man, I don't know if I want to do that. That's kind of dangerous. I'm going to log out of my own stuff here. And I'm going to share the screen with King Nip. With everybody, actually, in case somebody else had this. Bear with me because it's going to probably play one. Oh, it didn't. Thank goodness. All right, King Nip. I should have did this from the jump, man. If you look at my channel, you got to subscribe. I went to the homepage. All I typed was points blank travel. And I went to YouTube, typed points blank travel. Then right by the subscribe. I'm not subscribed to my own channel. But right beside that is join. If I click join, want to join this channel, sign, I have to sign in because I just signed out to be able to show you this. If you're signed in under King Nip, then it will allow you to join. So hopefully you're still in here. That give you total... Right there. All you got to do is go to Points Blank Travel, go to YouTube. I go to YouTube.com or YouTube, whatever. Points Blank Travel. And then when that, my homepage come up, right next to subscribe is join. All right. Let me get here. Let me kill that. All right. Let me pull this back up. Pull my comments back up. What it? What it? What it? What it? All right. Y'all bear with me here. All right. And not just says I've been fighting, joining clubhouses for a while, but I stand by it now so much networking and free knowledge is crazy. I joined a group and randomly met. Oh, you met Grant Cordon? Didn't get to talk to him, though. Uh, I actually was in a, a seminar. I mean, in a live seminar, Nigel. Uh, When I first got into sales, it wasn't even a seminar, it was a training session. And I had an opportunity to meet Grant Cardone in person. And I mean, he wouldn't remember me from a, a can of paint right now. That dude is the king of sales, man, the king of sales. And I tell you, uh, boy, <laughs> he's good. That's all I'll say, he's good, man. But yeah, I'm gonna have to check that out. Right, I'm going to bed, okay, I just I just sent it. Hopefully, I don't know if you're still in here, King Nip, I, I saw that kind of late. Uh, uh, get Business Chris said, Nigel, I've had many subscribers wanted me to join Clubhouse, but I used Samsung. So last week, I ordered an iPhone just to get on Clubhouse. Heard it is a great platform. Yeah, I've heard that too, and I definitely got to check it out. So I'll be hollering at you and Josh about that. Uh, Nigel says they have it for Android now. He, <laughs> a little late. He got the iPhone now. Nigel said, hit me up. I'll get you an invite. All right. Uh, yeah, I know, man. Get business, uh, business credit. Say, I need to retire the COVID chair. Man, I just love that chair. It's retired right now. Trust me, I ain't had no choice. It fell apart on me. All right. Uh, that's just uh, get business credit. Nigel talking about, and I'm, I want to go ahead and read it because some other people may be interested. Said, last time I checked, it was iPhone only. They do good to know. Going to download right now. Uh... Ed Nigel, they do that. Okay, that's the one I just read. Uh, Ed Nigel, thanks, boy. We'll hit you up soon. We'll give you a plug on my stream tomorrow night. Cool, cool. Ed Business Credit, yes, sir. Just invited an Android user today. And Dion says, appreciate the support, Rod. I really mean that. I'm sure you still remember how busy it is and responsible of being an LPO before you put on anchors. Yes, I do, man. I think I was an LPO. Uh, LPO is a leading petty officer, for those of you that don't know. I was an LPO at... at at the rank of E5 and also at E6, probably for about a year and a half, and then I transferred 
but yes, it, it, it is a lot of responsibility. It's actually, it's just as hard being an LPO as it is a chief. Almost just as hard, almost. Uh, and Ulysses is asking Nigel and Get Business Credit, what is Clubhouse? It's, it's pretty much a networking platform, Ulysses. Uh, I'm not gonna get deep into it. Hey, we got 23 people in the crib, 24 people rang the doorbell. I have been rolling for an hour and 25 minutes. Now is the time to ask your questions if you have any. Uh, I'm gonna be on here in a few more minutes, I must admit. Uh, doing a members of the live stream last night. This live stream tonight, I'm a little tired. Uh, also, uh, whatever happened to my time today, I did a lot. So definitely gonna be getting out of here shortly. Uh, Get Business Credit says uh, Clubhouse is like Facebook, but it is invite only like, uh, from my understanding, I'm sorry, with some in my screen. All right, man, we got Miss Poolart in the crib coming in here with that super, super chat. chat. That $10 super chat. You are appreciated by many. And thanks for your service to us at PBT. Love PBT. Thank you so much, Ms. Poolar. I, I, Ms. Poolar is kind of low-key now. I never know when she's in the stream or not in the stream. And that really means a lot. Uh, the super chat means a lot. But then when you hear someone, uh, and I know Dion can attest to this. And I know Ms. Poolar has a son that's serving our country. But when you hear, thank you for your service, it, it, it's at least for me, it means a lot because people don't have to say that. Some people uh, say it. I was on the phone with a, a business representative today from a company and uh, was explaining that I was in the military for 20 years. And she said about 10 words of what she had to say. And she stopped in, in the middle of her script, her spill or whatever, and said, thank you for your service. And when you hear that, man, people don't have to say that. And the funny part is I say it now. I say it, I, I filled quite a few calls and I make a lot of calls at my regular job. And when I hear someone that's in the military, I don't care what branch, Army, Navy, Air Force, Marines, Coast Guard, National Guard, whatever, hey, thank you for your service, man. Especially those that are currently serving because those are the people that are now protecting me. I protected people for 20 years, but now they're out there, people that are protecting me, protecting us, and I sincerely thank them. So Ms. Poulard, that means a lot. Man, I, I'm 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 rarely speechless, but I'm I'm speechless. So thanks so much. That really means a lot. Good to see you, by the way. Good to see you. Uh, let's see here. Mikey T says my girlfriend just got rid of uh, Dime Savings Bank. I never heard of it, which was giving her major issues. She moved to Chase, got a two hundred twenty-five dollar bonus on a checking, but nothing on savings. Thinking she should have not gone with savings. Uh, savings is not bad. Typically, most people these days, uh, <coughs> excuse me, they're, they're, they put their money in a checking account because they're moving money with debit cards in and out of checking accounts. And how many people are really saving in a traditional savings account right now? I have several savings accounts, Mikey T, but uh, they typically won't give you anything because they have been the banks. They're not really making, they're making money off these uh checking accounts with whether it's with your fee your monthly fees with you using the debit card they're making money so with a savings account they're not making as much money and that's probably why they offer a bonus so um i i, I don't know but chase at least she's got to start with chase and next is to have a look at those credit cards man that that's a good move ulysses says i will see you on the next live stream bye for now good live stream bye for now have a great week yes sir you too ulysses michael t says i was also, thank you for your service, Rob. Man, I really appreciate that, bro. And, but, and more important, not more importantly, just as important, I guess, or uh, more importantly right now, is I want to thank all of you for, for the support that you give me, uh, the support you give Points Blank Travel. It really means a lot. Uh, it, it, it goes without saying, man, without you guys, you ladies. I, when I say you guys, I'm talking about guys and ladies. I, I hate when I have to clarify that, but... Without y'all, it wouldn't be no points for my travel. So I appreciate your commitment to points for my travel and you tuning in and subscribing and all of that. That, that really means a lot. So I, I accept the thanks, but I want to thank you. I want to take a moment to thank you guys because of what I'm doing right now, this, this was a dream that I had for a couple of years before I even got brave enough to, to put that foot forward to even create a YouTube channel. Um, 
I actually went three, four months with my Facebook group before I even put that final nudge to myself uh, to even start this. So I thank everybody for all your support. That, that really means a lot. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey, Josh says, uh, get business credit, says 20 years broke, thank you. What branch? I was in the Navy, U.S. Navy. Uh, started from the bottom to the top, went from E1 to E8. Um, served with some great people. Uh, matter of fact, the guy, the two guys I showed at the beginning of this live stream, uh, we all were in the Navy. We all served at uh, Naval Air Station North Island in Coronado, California, which is an island right in San Diego uh, at the Communications Center of 94-95, uh, 1994 And here it is. Oh, man, I had that up. Is that 27 years later? Uh, 17 years later? Man, I can't even add right now. I got to, whatever it is, uh, we still kick it like it was yesterday. We still show each other love, show each other respect, and it's just a, it's a blessing to be able to, to, to have those friendships and those camaraderies that you developed years and years and years ago. So, All right, Ulysses says, good vibes. Thank you so much, Ulysses. I really appreciate that. I really appreciate it. Uh, Ulysses says, you got this. Yes, sir. And Miss Pular says, good night. Uh, good night, PBT. Thank you so much for uh, tuning in, Ms. Pular. Thank you so much for the the super chat, and thank you so much for the the thanking me for my service, man. I, I just just thank you, <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you for everything. Seriously, I always tell you that. Thank you for everything. Oh, okay. Give me credit. Nice army here. Okay, I ain't mad at you, Josh. But nowhere near twenty years. Two thousand two. Okay, you got out in two thousand two. Man, hey, two years, four years, you can't even do two years now in the Navy. I don't, three years either. Back when I first joined, you could do two years, three years, four years, and six years. Now I know with the Navy, it's a minimum of four. You can still do six. Man, two years, four years, three years, one year, if you serve, you serve, man. And I don't care what branch it is. I don't care what branch. If you serve, I'm down with you. I'm, I'm just... I, and I respect it because a lot of people can't do what people that serve either do or have done. There's a lot of people out there that can't do it. And, and on the flip side of that, there's a lot of people out there that want to do it, but there were certain circumstances that prevented them from doing it. It could be a medical condition. It could be a mental condition. So it's, it's so many different variables out there, man. But, hey, thank you for your service, bro. I really appreciate it. Okay, I got I got your kiddos waking up. Got to run. I'm about to get out of here myself. Uh, <laughs> okay, okay. All right, y'all. Man, we got 21 people still in the crib. Right, serious. Right now is the time because I gotta take a bathroom break. We can keep going, but I'm gonna have to take a, a, a. Not that I'm gonna be in the bathroom in two minutes, but you know, getting there, washing my hands, all that. I can take a two minute break. We got 20 people still in the crib. Uh, I can keep rolling, but uh, but I, I don't. Nineteen people still in the crib. Let me see here. We got. Make sure if you're just coming in. I see we got some new people coming in. Make sure you're ringing the doorbell, and the doorbell is that thumbs up button down below. Make sure you smash that joint. Or if you came in the crib. And forgot to ring the doorbell because it was a party going on. You was in a hurry to get in here see what was going on. Make sure you ring that joint on the way out. Jamal, what's going on, Jamal? I haven't seen you in a minute, man. He said, how's your crypto portfolio doing? I hope you bought it last week. Dip, laugh. I'm like, yeah, I bought it last week. I bought something yesterday. I bought something today. I bought something the day before that. I'm buying it at the dip, the top of the dip. I mean, let me quit tripping now. Yes, I did buy something at the dip. But I, I even, and I did it, um, I do it with stocks. And I know crypto is not stocks. I do what they call dollar cost average. So uh, every month I'm gonna buy something. It depends on what's what that's currently in my portfolio. It depends on what's up, what's down. I am watching several people and I'm getting several different strategies. 
Um, Brian Jung, who's a fellow uh, credit card YouTuber, uh, he's doing a lot of videos on crypto, a lot of live streams, checking him out. So, yeah, it, it's doing pretty good. It's doing good. But, yeah, I did by last week, man. Good to see you, Jamal. Okay, Nigel said it wouldn't take me because of my asthma. Yeah, that's a huge reason that the military won't let you in because of asthma. Uh, a lot, a lot, it's a lot of medical issues that people wouldn't even think. Um, and it's a lot of people that get in that don't disclose those issues. I'm not saying do that, but it's a lot of people uh, that that don't disclose information just so they can have that opportunity. Uh, I can either confirm or deny whether I did that. And, and I know give business credit and other people that may have been in have heard that term oh so many times I can't either well if you watch a lot of movies I can't confirm nor deny you know we had several spills for that Adolfo what's up my main man Adolfo is a co-worker of mine and it's always good he asked me uh yesterday what's the topic gonna be tonight I, I, he asked me yesterday it was Tuesday and I said, I'm doing a, because I told him I may do a live stream too. I said, well, I'm doing a members only live stream. He's like, oh, man, forget that. And that's how I do one Wednesday. He's like, what's the time? I said, I don't know yet, man. I'll come up with one. He said, what's up, Rod? I'm a little late, but made it, man. You know, it's funny because Adolfo, I think I'm off on Wednesdays and he's off on a different day. So he has direct uh, access to me on a daily basis. And he, I closed when? Tuesday, not Monday. And he and I sit in at my job probably the last hour, hour and a half. We were just talking credit cards, man. And it was so refreshing because he's a young man that's on his journey. Um, he's on his journey and starting and to see where he started and where he is now, it is it, it's beautiful, man. So I take great pleasure. You know, and it's cool. It's even more of an honor to see Adolfo tune into my videos and my live streams because he's there, he's really live with me every day. He's, he's a, uh, uh, he said, he, he's there every day and he's really live. He, he's there live, like in living color live. <laughs> but it's good to see you, my man. Hope all is well. I don't know if you're working today or not. Miss Poulard says, thank you for your service as well. Get business credit. Yes, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much. Okay, I know you had a Capital One. You have a couple Capital One cards, Adolfo, uh, with the annual fee. So, uh, I definitely understand that. Miss Dalton, got another channel member in the crib. Miss Dalton says, I'm late, but hey, PBT, hey, Miss Dalton, how you doing? Glad, yeah, you, you, you late. I've been rolling for an hour and 37 minutes and 50 seconds to be exact. Uh, but it's, it's better late than never, kind of what Adolfo was just saying, man. Just glad to have you in another live stream. Just check out the replay. Uh, we did quite a bit of talking, a uh, lot of interaction tonight. Several YouTubers in the house, and that's always cool. Again, make sure y'all check them out. Nigel Schroeder still in the building, I see. Joe Ford, my man, Joe's still hanging. Thank you so much, Joe. Joe says, Army here, 1971 to 1974. And I could tell you, Again, I salute you, Joe, because that's when the military was for real, for real. And I, you don't really hear me say no, for real, for real. I'm not young like that, but it, it was for real. And and not discounting the military. I was in the military that's going on now, but Army in 71 and 74, man, you 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 had to be, in, and, and, and there's no other way to put it, you had to be a soldier. And when I was in there, you, you know, you had to have, you had to be, tough but not like 71 to 74 so joe man thank you so much for your service man appreciate you sir for paving the way for people like myself you know i was uh i met up with a guy at my job um man this is about a year or two years ago and somebody had told him i was in the military when i introduced myself and he he said uh uh what rank did you retire i said an e8 and he was like wow that's pretty pretty high up i said yeah and I almost didn't want to ask, but I had to ask. I said, so what did you retire? So I retired as an E-4. Uh, and it was during the time when, probably kind of around the same time that Joe served. And I, the dude started, he, he came to tears because I said, you know what, sir? I really don't care what I retired as, what rank I retired as. I just want to take the time. He, he retired as an E-4, so that's half of the rank that I retired as. 
I say it really don't matter. I retired at E8, you retired at E4, but I want to take the time to thank you for paving the way for people like me to be able to have an opportunity to even serve. And the dude broke down in tears, man. He, it, it's just a humbling, he, he, he knew that I meant what I was saying. I don't get caught up in all the, the who, who in charge, who ain't in charge. Dude, if it wasn't for you, I couldn't have done what I did. And even my mentors, one of my mentors was in the live stream a couple months ago. Anyway, man, let me let me get back on track here. Uh, Nigel says, I didn't know it was a PDQ until they told me. Uh, uh, I know that's a disqualification. I, I can't remember what the P, a PDQ, until they told me in my family that it was, that was in the military. It was like, you're stupid for telling them that. <laughs> I can't say that, Nigel, but some, a lot of people don't disclose everything that's going on because they know the, uh, It'll, it'll mess up their opportunity or their chances of getting in. But I wouldn't say you were stupid. You just told the truth. All right. Adolfo says, I had a Capital, uh, Capital One Platinum with a $300 credit limit. <coughs> for more than six months in the Capital One Quicksilver with a $500 credit limit, should I ask for a credit increase on the Platinum? No, you should not. No. No, you should not. You only had the car six months, and you had the. Uh, you just got the Quicksilver not long ago. No, don't ask for no credit limit increase. Just chill out. Uh, great question, but what I would do. A lot of times when you apply, I'm not saying go apply for another card either. I'm not saying that. So hear me out, my man. Hear me out. A lot of times. You'll get a big, a larger credit limit if you apply for another card than you will. So many people spend so much time worrying about these credit limit increases. I, I'm gonna I'm go ahead and date myself. The last time I asked, I'm trying to think, the last time I asked for a credit limit increase, y'all, was I'm trying to think. On the real, was night. 1999. That's the last, and I'm not trying to quote no Prince songs or nothing like that. The last time I asked for a credit limit increase was 1999. <clears throat> and, and Adolfo and everybody else out there, as you build your credit, and, and I know Nigel can attest to this because he got a stack of cards as well, as you build your credit, you're going to have some credit card issues that's going to give you a I, my 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 uh. City Double Cash has a thousand dollar limit, man. I, I mean, okay, guess what? I just won't use it a lot. My uh, Discover E card has a two thousand dollar limit. Guess what? I won't use it a lot. But then when I break out my guns, my top guns, my big dogs, my Amexes, my Golds, my Platinums, my my Bank of America Premium Rewards, my uh, Capital One Ventures, my World of Hyatts, and all the cards that's in here. My freedom, my freedom flex, and we're talking about twelve five, twelve thousand five hundred dollars credit limit and up. I don't care about these one two thousand dollar credit limits. I just use a different card. So as you create more credit, as you create more opportunities, you create more options, and you're not so caught up and focused when you have minimal opportunities and minimal options. So my answer to you, Adolfo, right now you're working with two credit cards, which is plenty but you have minimal opportunities and minimal options. That's gonna grow, it's gonna continue to grow. And when you have maximum opportunities and maximum op options, you're not gonna worry about this $300 credit limit, this $500 credit limit, they they're gonna give you one. But everybody out there know, and I know you may not know, I think we talked about it, if we did, we're gonna talk about it right now, we're gonna talk about it again tomorrow at work if you're not off. Capital One is very stingy with credit limits, so don't get caught up on that, please. Please, all right, where we at here? All right. Or I'll wait for the quick silver when I have more to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just chill out. Just chill out. We ain't gonna, we, but I'm going to answer this here for all the general public. Just chill out, bro. Just chill out, man. Don't worry about no credit limit increases. I'm going to give you the raw T strategy. Deborah. Deborah's still in the crib. Okay, Deborah, I didn't know if you had left. You know, I don't know if you I don't know if you're still here or not if you ain't coming, but I'm glad to see you still here. She said, here with you, dropping that knowledge. Hashtag golden. 
again, man, that is, is comments like this, man, that just make me feel like what I'm doing is worthwhile. Thank you so much for that, that, that wonderful comment, Deborah. I try. All I can do is say I try. All right, man. I, I'm telling you, it's going to be a flood in here in a minute. <laughs> hey, hey, uh, uh, Adolfo, I hope you're still in here. Let me know what time is it? I don't know if you drive, and I don't know if you work today. I don't know if you, and you may be still at work. Uh, my platinum is still five, and I just said my platinum, Capital One Platinum, Adolfo, and everybody else out there, is still 500. I use it for a monthly subscription. Uh, gave up on CLI, which is credit limit increase, especially with Capital One. At the same here, just so y'all know, man, um, I won't get deep into it. I'm, I'm just going to put a, a, I have over, well over $200,000 in credit limits with my credit cards, well over. And I'm not telling this story so y'all can be impressed with me having $200,000 in credit limits. Who cares? Because I, I ain't got $200,000 to pay it if I ever blow it up to that. So it really, for other than having a higher credit score, it really don't matter. But my platinum card from Capital One, matter of fact, drum roll, please. My credit limit on my Capital One Platinum card is a whopping, a astronomical, a phenomenal $750. And I've had this card about eight years, nine, ten years, at least eight, seven, eight. My credit limit is seven hundred fifty dollars, man. <laughs> Matter of fact, it's kind of comical when I think about it. Seven hundred and fifty bucks. I, I, if I felt like, I, I think I don't think I have my face ID set to that. I would log in and show you seven hundred foot. I'm not gonna say what can I do with seven hundred fifty dollars, but what can I do with seven hundred fifty dollars? I can do a lot, but I mean, come on, man. That that is just. The fact that they haven't uh, given me a credit limit increase, I don't care what the limit is, but kind of like Nigel. I mean, I haven't had a credit limit increase in eight years. Come on, man. <laughs> I mean, but they, they don't trip because they know I have the Quicksilver One. I don't really use it. They know I have my Venture card that I, I use it quite frequently, so they know I ain't really tripping on the Capital One Platinum card. But make sure you guys, here's another, uh, why Deborah was bringing up that. Make sure you guys, if nothing else, man, use your card. If you only have a few cards, let's say if you have five or less. Uh, and I pointed this out to the members last night. Uh, if you have five or less cards, man, make sure you use your cards, all of them. I don't care if you get nothing back or not, especially with, with the way the economy is right now. Use your card every month. If you have five or less cards, use all five. But don't buy nothing big. Don't go buy nothing crazy. Kind of what Nigel, and you could tell who the 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 YouTubers or the, the credit nerds, the credit gurus, whatever you want to call us. Like, I have a monthly subscription on my um, Platinum card as well. It's funny how two people that talk about this, and Nigel and I have never discussed this. We've never talked about this one-on-one. -on -one. And we talk on the phone. We text. We talk on the phone. We've never talked about it. But he has a card. That he puts among the descriptions, so do I, is to keep that activity on there. Use your card. If you have five or less, use them once a month. Get a bag of Doritos. You always hear me say, get a Slurpee, get a bag, a pack of powder donuts. I, I, I pointed it out to the members, and I usually don't discuss what I discuss in the members on the live streams and the regular live streams, but I have, uh, I think I pointed out, maybe it was another live stream, I don't know, but I have 27 cards, and it's only three cards that don't get used every month, three or four. So I'm reusing 23 cards every month, at least. 23, at least once. Now the ones that I'm rolling with in my wallet, these, uh, just today alone, I used my, I used my World of Hide, I used my Venture, I used my Freedom Flex, I mean my Freedom Unlimited, no I didn't use it, I used my Freedom Flex, I used my Business Goal, and I used my Personal Goal, I used every, one, two, three, four, five out of eight cars today. Five out of eight just today. And I only went to three places, three or four. But I go to the grocery store, man. I'm, actually, I'm all over the... Man, I'll be at the self-checkout for a minute. <laughs> you heard me? I be, boy, oh, that's, that, that's, that, that's that Master P coming out. You heard me? I'll be there for a minute. I, I go in there with five items. I do five transactions. My boy, uh, it's a dude, man. He see me every Wednesday. I go there every Wednesday on my off day. Larry... And he was like, hey, man, my day is complete. You in the house, man. And Larry, I don't know how old, who cares how old he is, but he's like, how many how many transactions are we doing today? He already know. I said, oh, man, we're going to do about three, four today, Larry, at least four. 
And he started laughing. He said, man, I love you, dude. You cracked me up. Uh, <clears throat> so, all right, Miss Dalton says, I just closed my account with them at the... I just closed my account at the, at, with them at this point. No, no, because I got to look at that average age of accounts. And the average age of accounts is, is, is part of your credit score, Ms. Dalton. And, and my Capital One Platinum is probably my second or third oldest card on my credit report. So I don't really want to get rid of it. I, I mean, I think I even have an annual fee for $39 on this joint, I think. Uh, I just, I just, just I just keep it, but no, uh, because I'm not I'm not tripping. I have I have too many other credit limits that I, matter of fact, I finally got a new the new version of the Quicksilver One card, but I don't even think I have an updated version of the, the Platinum card. I think I still got the the old version with the numbers and I mean I got other cards with numbers in front of them, but they, they didn't they didn't really step the game up. We've been going an hour and fifty minutes here. Yeah, my computer's plugged up. If this camera does trip, I will change the battery. I always keep a backup battery because uh, I never know how long these live streams will go. And Nigel says, three years old, second oldest car. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's why I, I'm not, I, I'm not, I'm not. I got to cancel a card or downgrade it this year, and I'm probably just going to cancel it that I've had for since 2017, and it's going to kill me to cancel that card. It ain't going to kill my credit score. It's just going to hurt me. My heart, because I don't, I, not the card, just the fact that I don't like counseling a card. I, 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 and I may just downgrade it. If I down, even if I downgrade it, I'm still gonna be paying 150 dollars annual fee and getting absolutely nothing out of it. Uh, so, uh, and no, it's not an American Express card. Uh, and I'm probably gonna end up downgrading my platinum card to the uh, um. My platinum card to the green card because I have the Charles Wall platinum as well. Hey, we got another channel member in the crib. We got Vince Lawson in the crib. Vince, I owe you an apology, man. I saw your comment, but I've been on the move all day. I haven't had a chance to respond. Um, and I, I'm glad you're here. Uh, he says, good evening, Coach. Checking in from Augusta, Georgia. Hey, no problem, man. Thank you so much for the kind words. And Vince uh, commented today because he missed the members only live last night. He didn't get the notification. He asked, could I text him when I'm going to go live? And I was thinking to myself, yeah, I can for now. But as, as the channel grows, it's going to be kind of hard. The best way to do it, Vince, and, and please put down here in the comments, if you are... Uh, Uh, if, if you are uh, on Facebook, do me a favor. Check out point, uh, PBT VIP, PBT space VIP. That is the members only group on Facebook. I, before I do a members only live, actually before I do any live, I po I definitely post it there. Uh, even tonight on my face to my regular Facebook group, Points Point Travel, my uh, Facebook page, Points Point Travel, and to the PBT VIP, which is the Points Blank Travel YouTube channel members group. I post the link to all three, and I'll let you know when I'm going live, members, especially members only live. Uh, I, if you're on Facebook, I would check out joining that or, 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 or getting part of that. Or if I have time, like tonight, I didn't have time to send out texts that I was going live. Now, if it's one or two people, yeah, that's easy. But if I, once I get up to five or 10, it's going to be kind of tough. But yeah, uh, check it out. Hold up, bear with me. I just got a tick. Uh, hold on. All right. All right, but uh, hopefully you're still tuning in, uh, Vince. Hey, Andre, another channel member in the crib says, hey, Rob, what's going on, my man? I know I'm late. I apologize. I hope all is well. All is well and no apologies needed, man. Check out the replay or check us out on the next live stream. Uh, I do believe I'm not making no promises right now. We got 27 people in the crib, 27 people rang the doorbell. I know we've had more than 27 people in here because I've been watching the traffic go in and out. I can kind of see all this on my screen. Uh, no apologies needed. I, I, I don't want to put a date or put myself on a schedule but i like to finish each month on youtube strong so there's a high possibility there will be another live stream and there's a very high possibility between now and the end of the month definitely one next wednesday 
uh, my schedule live streams. Um, definitely some videos coming out. The goal is, well, not counting this one, at least one more live stream and two more videos before the end of the month. That is the goal. Um, the gold. <laughs> you know, I got money on my mind. The gold. Sorry about that. Not the gold. Uh, I'm going to roll a dice real quick. And I, I'm not I'm talking about shooting no craps, but I am going to use the restroom. Actually, let me see. It's 26 people still in here. Oh, man. Hold on real quick. Let Deborah says the Tomo card gave me a limit of five thousand dollars. Sent me the sent me the app to fill out. What do you think? Hi Nigel, listen to you too. Um, I I don't know. The Tomo card is a good starter card. Uh, I'm not too knowledgeable on the on Tomo card. I did have a, a and I'm about to be because I had a. I want to say it was Marcus Hamilton asked me to do a video or a live stream on the Tomo card. A uh, $5,000 credit limit. Uh, I would say a $5,000 credit limit on any card and the Tomo is a starter card. I think that's pretty good. So I would definitely, uh, I would definitely go ahead and, and, and give that a close look. I'm not going to tell you whether to apply or, or take it. Or accept the offer, but I would definitely give it a closer look. Hey, Nigel, I know you're. Uh, uh, I know you're up on the the Tomo Eight. What do you think, man? It's, and it's always good to have other YouTubers in here and get other perspectives. Uh, tell me what you think, Nigel. If you're still in here, I'm pretty sure you are. But now, Deborah, let, let me ask this. Uh, they gave you a limit, sent you the app to fill out. So they gave you a limit of 5,000. So you haven't been approved for the card yet. You haven't accepted the card. Let me know. I need a little more, uh, a little more on this here. That, that would really help. Miss Dawson says, hey, Nigel, I love your channel as well. Yes, sir. It's good to have my main man, Nigel, in the crib tonight. It's been a minute since he's been in my live stream. I know I was in his not long ago because he's been so busy so it's always a pleasure like i said earlier to have other youtubers in the house and i'm going to put the pressure on nigel we've done it before we're going to do it again we've talked about it recently i'm not sure if it's going to be on his channel it may we may do one on his channel we may do one on my channel but we are going to be collaborating very soon right nigel i mean and this is i mean uh, we talked about it last time i was on his channel his live stream uh we mentioned it and we kind of went back and forth but we haven't had the opportunity to actually talk about it over the phone with me being busy, him being busy, but that is something that's definitely in the works. And I can tell you the last one we did, and I let Nigel say it, it, it was one that if you missed it, you you miss a, a heck of a show. So Nigel says, hi, Deborah Nigel says, hello, Miss Dalton. We got Jason, uh, Jason Maitland says, been on the wait list for, now, oh, that Tumble card is that card well, you gotta, oh man, yeah. You gotta get on the wait list, Jason. Hey, he, school me, Jason. I think it's a car where you gotta get on the wait list because I remember Dwayne from How to Build Credit TV did a video on this or a live stream. Uh, he did a live stream when it first came out. So you gotta get on the wait list, then you move up the wait list. Nothing wrong with those. Uh, uh, I, I right now for me there but I'm not just starting now if I was just starting I'm gonna do what I had to do but if since I'm not just starting I'm not worried about no wait list right now but that's right that's right now let me take let me go back six years ago five six years ago rod rod would have got on a wait list the rod now won't but the rod five, and one, one, let me let me explain the difference between rod now and rod five or six years ago. So the rod five or six years ago was a 540, 547 credit score. Rod didn't have no credit. Rod didn't know nothing about credit. Rod would have got on the wait list and took any credit that was available to help him build his credit. So yes, 
Yes, I would look at the Tomo card. Let me jump down in here. Uh, Nigel says, I would take it if you're new to credit and can't get that limit from another bank. Yes, exactly what I was just saying. Deborah says, they approved me, but they finally sent me the application. They check your banking account to look at your activity. And that's cool. And if they don't give you five thousand, they give you three thousand. They give you two thousand. They give you one thousand. Deborah, it's a start. We all, you. If you watch some of my older videos, you have to crawl before you walk. I didn't make that up. That's, I'm not the first person to ever say that. But you have to crawl before you walk. You have to start somewhere. Who? I mean, I, I. If you're just starting, I would. I would. I would take it. I would go for it. Nigel says, oh, yeah, the live stream will be will for sure be soon. Uh, last time we talked about it, Nigel said he got to sleep for a whole day because he got to make sure his energy level is on the same level as mine. I thought that was so funny uh, because I think his energy level is we just two different people. But, man, I'm looking forward to that, Nigel. I, I am looking forward to that. All right, Deborah says, I waited for four months. Chase King is back. He was driving. Now he back. He said, what's up, my people? What's up, my people? I'm and I'm back, okay? Hey, y'all, give me a half a second. I am going to mute the mic. I have to use the restroom. If people are still in here, we got, okay, man, what did I hit? 22 people in the crib. I am going to use the restroom real quick. If we got people still in here, we'll keep rolling. Uh, and if.
All right, sorry about that, man. The battery died while I was uh, relieving myself. Uh, make sure everything's straight here. All right, so Nigel, how many people? We got 20 people still in the crib. Thank y'all for hanging in there. I really appreciate it. Nigel said, I got to sleep two days now for sure. <laughs> you got to sleep two days. Oh, man, hold up. I, I, I forgot something. Hold up, y'all. Forgot my cup, man. Oh, man. I came back and saw that screen black and it threw me off a little bit. All right, let's see here. So, now I just I got to sleep two days now for sure. I've been out of town, ATL in Fort Lauderdale, plus uh, Platinum Canaan Kennels has two litters on the ground, plus balancing jobs, credit, and YouTube. Yeah, man, you got a lot going on, bro. Woo, that's a whole lot. That's a whole lot. Chase King says, Nigel, yes, you need to sleep. I see you're always yawning in your videos. <laughs> hey, man, Nigel talking about making a, a, a T-shirt with him yawning or something like that. Marcus says, what's up to the great Chase King? Nigel says, yes, sir, Chase King. Thank you, though. Been working on that. Yeah, man. I, I got used to it, so I don't say nothing. Ulysses says, welcome back. I thought you was done. You the one said, bye, Ulysses. You said bye earlier and said uh, you will see me in the next live stream. I wasn't done, man. I, my, my, I had to use the restroom and then my battery died. Now I'm looking at my lights. They doing all kinds. Matter of fact, I got it over too far here. Oh, man, I had it halfway, right? It don't matter, because I ain't going to be on here much longer anyway. No, I'm about to be done, though, Nige. I am about to be done, my man. 18 people in the crib, 33 people rang the doorbell. Well, I tell you what, unless y'all got something else to talk about, I'm glad y'all hung around, but I'm kind of out of words. So unless y'all got something else to talk about, I am going to raise up out of here. I have been rolling for about two hours and eight minutes now. So, uh do me a favor, if you're watching this on a replay, if you haven't already done so, subscribe to the channel. I would greatly appreciate it. Make sure if you didn't smash the thumbs up, if you didn't hit the like button, if you didn't ring the doorbell on the way in, make sure you ring the doorbell on the way out. I would highly appreciate it. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, I, uh, it, it, I'm, I'm sorry, man. I, I was reading this text message. <laughs> but yeah, man, it, it's, now is the time to say what you got to say. If you haven't already done so, man, subscribe to the channel. Share the channel with your family and friends, man. That That's probably the biggest gift you could give me. Um, I'm really trying to get this information out there. I uh, want to help people prosper. I uh, want to help people grow. It was so funny when I was out with my boys, Rich and DeJoy, this past weekend. Uh, everybody we came across, Rich was like, hey, man, check out Points Blank Travel. This dude is dropping, he, 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 he just said he's dropping knowledge. He didn't say gems, boulders, nuggets. Uh, and I, I was, the first night I wasn't with the Sunday when we went out, I had a, a PBT shirt on, not the Let's Roll Baby, but the emblem and the Educate Motivated uh, elevate on the back and so many people are like what is that what what is that elevate educate and motivate and I was like oh just you know uh, my my company that I, I want to inspire people to be all they can be I want to inspire them to be the best I want to inspire them to 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 make the impossible possible uh, and I did a video why I I, I, man, I can't remember it was a while back uh, making the impossible possible so definitely want to Keep doing that. So, man, share the channel with your family and friends. Jason says, thank you. Uh, have a great night. You too as well. Chase says, good night, family. Yes, sir. Well, your boy's about to get up out of here. Uh, okay, I thought I was. Marcus says, I do have a, a great question, Rod. I took my Fingerhood account that would be in collections about four months ago. I contacted them the other day. They let me know the account was removed from the system. Okay, that's good. It's removed from the system, uh, Marcus but was it removed from your credit report? Is it still on your credit report? That's what's key. And, and you may be kind of saying that, but I want to know, them removing it from their system is cool, 
Uh, boy, I can't wait to get her hair cut. And this is just natural. I don't even have nothing on it, and it is long. Um, but uh, I think you just kind of answered my question. Can I dispute the account to get removed from my credit report? The finger cut. Yeah, you can, but what you really need to do, I would talk to Fingerhood and see if they're going to remove it from the system. Whoop to do, good, fine and dandy. But are you going to remove it from my credit report? Report, uh, and it was in collections, not all the time. But I've had accounts that was on my credit, and something happened to the company, and the next time, no, it wasn't on my credit. Now. Sometimes you will have companies that will sell their debt to another company, a collection agency or something. Sometimes they just go in there, these collection agencies, pick them up. Uh, I've had stuff come in the mail, just so y'all know, and say, hey, we're with XYZ Collections. This was way, way back in the day. And we want to settle this debt with you. And if, now, actually, last time I got it was like four or five years ago. And I'm laughing because it wasn't on my credit report. No, we ain't selling nothing. We can, we, we can sell it. You stop. You can keep sending me mail because it's costing you money to send me mail. But it's going straight to the trash. So, All right, man. I tell you what. Hopefully, that answered your question, Marcus. I am going to raise up out of here. Again, man, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. Hit that doorbell on your way out this joint. Share the channel with your family and friends that I'm so serious about this. And I will be coming at you soon, dropping even more knowledge. And make sure, man, make sure, make sure, make sure. Don't forget, shoot for the moon. If you don't make it, you will be amongst the stars, I can guarantee you. And until the next time, y'all have a great week. Have a prosperous and blessed week. And I will be seeing y'all soon. If you have any questions that didn't get answered in this live stream, you can always hit me up at pointsblanktravel at gmail.com. Or you can become a channel member and let me see if I still have it here. If you are interested in becoming a channel member and you'll have even more access to me, all you have to do is go, let me pull this up real quick. Go to my homepage, point, go to YouTube, type points blank travel. Go to Google, type YouTube, points blank travel. You'll see my homepage here right next to the subscribe button. Make sure you hit that join as well hit join you hit join i will have to sign in you sign in and then you can become a channel member if you don't have a youtube account all you need is a google uh, gmail account and it will take you to the promised land all right with all that being said your boy's gonna get ready to get up out of here make sure i don't have any last minute comments um we got the inaugural channel member that just joined in my main man mr maurice mile he was the first channel member and it's only fitting that he just came in right when i was talking about that he says blessings my brother blessings you maurice yeah i'm about to raise up my man he says i will see the replay i thank you so much and with all that being said hope y'all have a great rest of the week again i'll be coming back at you soon you never know make sure you subscribe to the channel make sure that you hit the notification bell make sure it's selected to all because it does default to personalize you have all personalize in the middle is where it's going to default you got to scroll up once you hit the notification bell and below is none make sure you have all selected and until the next time y'all have a great one i'll be coming at you soon peace